Chase me, chase me. Chase me. I'm faster than you. Hello, everybody. And I have an announcement for this meeting. Fuck! Big meeting plans. I think it'd be cool to be a police officer, but, but mm. I don't know. Hey, Poppy. Um, Hi. I see some people. Everybody wearing leather all of a sudden. Hey, Poppy. They see you look like a hippie. I fear it looks very nice on you, ma'am. That's a very tasteful do rag. Do you think that's a wig? Bald hippie. No, that makes sense. What? Grow back, that won't I'm make sure. any sense. That won't make any sense. And definitely won't. You know, well, you know, I mean, best of luck. You know, I, I'm sure if you have the experience, you know. Guys, I'm still waking up. Peace. Um. No. No. Wait. I. Re oh God. I really wish we had your um your closets. 
<clears throat> because I have to. Oh my god, my voice. Hello? Jesus Christ, that sounds worse than gonorrhea. We need to put him down. Geo might die. Huh? No, wait, what the lady um, that we arrested yesterday and uh, she bled out of her eyes, ears, and nose and then blew up? Oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> no way, not the time. Oh. Have they gotten a hold of like, Agent Orange or something like that? Okay. Oh, fuck, it sounds like it. She was speaking in tongues. Who is this Agent Orange? I hear so much about him. I've not had the pleasure to meet him yet. It's funny. Uh, no. Sorry, can I move oh, forward just a little? I'm having a problem hearing. I'm not Agent Orange at Tet. That would what? be a really cool name. I... Yeah, that's what you worry. I don't want to jump over you. My body's moving crank with Agent Orange. See, I oh. knew it. Agent oh, okay, I'm just going to not hear. <laughs> hey, Agent Orange. <laughs> Why are they blocking the okay. fucking oh, aisle? It's a, it's a fire hazard. hazard. Look out for, uh, things are getting pretty violent out there. You know what, uh, uh, Phoenix, uh, why don't you come up here and tell uh, everybody about the potential new penal code that's coming up? You folks need to be paying attention to... Uh, New charges that may be uh, cropping up here, uh, new times, fines, and their punishments, etc. Uh, Phoenix here might have a little bit if, of a better explanation. If I may, sir, uh, Chief, is, Chief Justice oh. Lewis Rehnquist, I can uh, oh, shit. present yeah, some information in relation yeah. to that. Yeah. Whoa, Chef of Justice. You, Douglas Wade told me about it, but you know, he probably got more. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Come on, man. Uh, oh, right. Let's see here. Yeah, we uh, we actually have the cards printed up. They've been sent over to the clerk. You should be updated. Can we ask here. about I conspiracy? Sometime, I don't know. Soon. Uh, the last time we sent the clerk over the cards, it took a couple uh, of hours. So we got a decent kind of just keep an eye on general things. Can ask uh, but we do have some relatively significant charges that we've changed. Uh, first and foremost, we have reclassified robbery A. Uh, that's going to include... Include, uh, right, automated teller machines now, uh, rather than that uh, per se falling under uh, uh, the robbery B. Uh, we received information indicating that individuals who rob these automated teller machines are stealing anywhere between three and six or seven hundred dollars, uh, whereas the fine for robbery B was approximately two thousand. Um, Let's, let's be transparent. Although these are technically the property of a bank, uh, there is a significant difference between an individual uh, purchasing a crowbar and jimmying one of these things open versus uh, holding a teller at gunpoint and you know, robbing a vault, for instance. Um, so we're, we're going to differentiate those and just move the ATMs under A. Um, pursuant to the orders of the Reagan administration, we are changing our drug laws uh, somewhat significantly. Uh, manufacturing of a controlled dangerous substance and possession of a controlled substance with the intent to distribute are now going to be stackable charges. Um, the, the verbiage will make itself a little more clear, but essentially for every 20 units of a controlled dangerous substance that somebody has, they will receive one additional charge of possession of a CDS with the intent to distribute. Um, meaning that whenever an individual is found with you know, 21 uh, units of whatever the CDS may be, they will uh, face a significantly lower penalty than someone who is uh, found with 80 or more because that individual will face you know four times that charge uh, similarly with manufacturing that one is going to be stacking based off of the number of precursor chemicals and or um, uh, total manufactured substances that are found on an individual 
uh, a specific situation was brought to our attention by Captain Bishop uh, pertaining to someone who was uh, located with uh, like a, a van full of uh, 10 bottles of like ammonia or ammonia nitrate or something along those lines, uh, along with already prepared batches of uh, methamphetamines. Uh, so from the from the point that this is instituted forward, every five units uh, the manufacturing charge will stack as well. So, for instance, if you were to find a group of individuals who I don't know have forty to sixty uh, precursor materials on them, then you would be uh, stacking that charge upwards of eight to ten times on those individuals. Uh, weapons trafficking is going to have a slight modification made to it. We realized uh, the verbiage as it currently exists does have a potential for abuse uh, built into it. Um, specifically, the transportation of the firearm in and of itself was one of the elements uh, under which it could be charged, so we've, we've just modified that to make it more clear that just carrying around a gun is not significant enough to charge you know, a weapons trafficking charge. Uh, let's see. Uh, illegal modification of a vehicle. We provided a little bit more clarity as to exactly what we mean by the illegal window tents. Uh, we received feedback from some of the uh, attorneys who represent uh, Benny's and other uh, other car modification shops. Um, so we made it a little bit more clear for both you guys and the general public as to what we mean by uh, the word quote unquote opaque, because apparently that was confusing people. Uh, and then the big ones. Uh, we are adding two new capital level slash life imprisonment charges. Um, one of them is going to be following a similar chain of what we've already been discussing. We are adding a drug trafficking charge. Oh, fuck. A held until trial slash life imprisonment charge. Uh, these are going to be for individuals who are found with more than 20 instances of a precursor or more than 500 instances of a controlled dangerous substance. Uh, so, yeah, these are going to be the, the, the very large manufacturing schemes that get broken down. Um, we're not really interested in every single individual who produces small amounts of uh, marijuana or methamphetamine facing these charges, but whenever large operations are broken down, we are... Uh, looking at hefty times in jail and hefty fines. Uh, and we are also adding a treason charge, um, which will specifically be, let me, uh, let me find the precise verbiage of that. Uh, so the exact verbiage that's going to be used for that is no person shall work to undermine the democratic processes of the state of San Andreas or its institutions, gain unlawful access to confidential information held by the state or its institutions, or cause severe disruption to vital city or state infrastructure at the direction or control of a foreign government or its agents uh, with the intent to serve that uh, foreign government's interests. Um, you know, very succinctly put we know that we have uh, enemies that are uh, both foreign and abroad and some of them may have made their way into our country so we have provided the Los Santos Police Department and the Attorney General's office a tool with which to deal with that um, but those are all the big changes that are going to be coming through everything else is relatively minor in comparison uh, we're hoping that over the next uh, 12 to 36 hours hopefully those uh, those cards in your MDT filing system should be updated are there any questions about the most recently implemented penal code or the new upcoming one that I can address while I'm here? Nobody got any questions. He just had a whole bunch of words. It was not a confusion, and I know that some of you dumb folks clarification. <laughs> Nori, do you need any clarification? Uh, you know, I can ask a question that I'm sure somebody here is asking. Uh... Unless an appeal has officially been made, we, we should not be dropping robbery B on already charged individuals down to robbery A, correct? That is correct. Uh, this will likely fall under uh, what 
can typically be called an amnesty law exception uh, whenever something is decriminalized or you know criminalized in a lower degree later uh, the attorney general's office may at their own election once an appeal is filed or records are requested they may opt to lower those charges uh, but for the time being that i do not expect you all to audit through the last several weeks of reports and just drop those per se oh thank you chief justice oh uh, actually could i get a clarification on what the new uh illegal modification uh, i know that Others found opaque, confusing, but uh, I was curious what the new uh, written law was. Uh, the new written law has an additional sentence at the end uh, that says, Opaque window tint shall be considered one of the application of blackout or limo tint on a vehicle. Uh, I believe Benny's uh, calls it blackout tint, so any vehicle that has the highest level of tint that is available. Uh, or to the application of tent uh, which on the vehicle would make it impossible for a reasonable person to see the driver or passengers of the vehicle from the outside um, and the reason we have to distinguish it that way with both the reasonable person language and the vehicle language is one because different vehicles are uh, subject to different levels of uh, light transparency, depending on how many windows they have, the height of the vehicle. I mean, we all know there's several fa factors that kind of play into that, right? Um, right. And two, uh, I would like you all to uh, look around the room and see how many of you are wearing sunglasses currently. So the, <laughs> the amount that you may be able to see through a window based on the sunglasses and the level of tint uh, they're from uh, is likely to be different than your average reasonable person. Um, I think uh, in, in layman's terms, if I was counseling you all, the, the CYA move would be to just take a photograph. That'll make it uh, pretty clear to the court whether you were uh, acting from a reasonable standpoint when issuing that citation. All right, because I did have an incident where I believe somebody... Uh they they told me they had the correct tint but i i couldn't see through it uh and it may have been because their vehicle was dirty uh very possibly yes uh the dirt of the vehicle and then a, a low rider you know two-door sports vehicle you know something like a uh something like a pontiac firebird is likely to show uh, the tents li liable to be a little darker than it would be for some other vehicles right so. just gonna check on a 95 they may, right. need to, they may need to bump it up a shade. All right, anybody got anything else? This is the Chief Justice here, folks. If you need some clarifying on something you don't understand, I suggest you do it now. Otherwise, I'm going to expect you all to be nigh fucking perfect when it comes to the processing and understanding these laws. Anybody have questions on the Constitution as well? All right, yeah. God damn it. All right, I'm going to just... May be. Yeah, I'm just going to keep asking questions that I know these the, these guys have, but oh, may not want to ask. Uh, self-defense, uh, I have read over it. Uh, if an individual claims self-defense, do, do you still want us to charge them? Uh, unless, of course, we can actually see their, their rationale and reasoning and no, we won't win that case. Um, that is going to be a matter of prosecutorial discretion. Obviously, that is something that we extend to both yourselves and the Attorney General's office. Um, no, I personally do not want you to push clearly losing matters to the docket just to shift the burden to the defendant. Uh, the reason that the language is written that way is specifically uh, so that once something reaches a trial stage, it is very clear who bears that burden uh, of proving that it was self-defense. It's not up to you guys in court to prove that uh, something wasn't self-defense. It's up to them to prove that it was. Um, so that, that's the reason that it's written that way. If you have a case where somebody gets dragged in and you as a reasonable police officer are aware that it was self-defense and all of the facts and circumstances point to the fact that it was oh, this is actually good to know. and that the individual was exercising the right to self-defense, uh, you can exercise your prosecutorial discretion to just not bring charges under those circumstances. So is it not worth like pushing some of them through just to set precedent? Uh, again, 
Uh, again, that's a prosecutorial discretion matter. If you would like to push something through because it's a borderline or a fringe case and you, you want to hear the court's opinions on it, then we're not going to toss it out uh, as a matter of principle. Um, but it's, you know, again, with the volume of cases that I, I've seen uh, go through your filing system, uh, I am aware that not every self-defense circumstance is something you all uh, will have the capacity to bring to court instantaneously, so. Hey, okay. Uh, I did speak with another judge about this. Uh, there are sections on, uh, was it accomplice or accessory after the fact? Uh, we also have charges about that. Uh, is there anything you wish to clarify on that matter? Uh, the charges are largely to be used in instantaneous situations. Um, so, for instance, we have the, um, uh, the, the accomplice charging. Uh, largely, that was a knee-jerk reaction towards seeing felony obstruction uh, kind of tossed around. Um, an individual who, for instance, uh, serves as a, uh, a pickup for someone um or who otherwise uh intervenes is not explicitly speaking obstructing justice obstructing justice is more of you know an individual who wanders onto a scene and refuses to leave or who intentionally or unintentionally uh destroys evidence without underlying motive um an individual who uh, is directly aiding and abetting a, and uh, a primary actor during the commission of offense is you know, they're either going to be an accessory before or after the fact, or they're going to be an accomplice uh, there too. So essentially those new charges are blanket charges uh, that you all may utilize at your discretion in order to charge, you know, individuals who pick up someone who's running on foot uh, or other various circumstances. The constitutional um, accomplice, accessory, and co-hate offenses, so on and so forth, uh, those are better utilized for actually articulating why the underlying charges uh, should stick to them. Understood. Uh, final one for me. Uh, conspiracy. Uh, what is your thoughts on charging an individual with conspiracy and the actual crime as opposed to conspiracy before they commit the crime? Uh, pick one or the other. And that would be my standpoint on that. Uh, Generally speaking, and I'm going to say this broadly for all of our criminal charges, um, if you have a crime where the elements or the exact actions that were committed are going to be identical for charging one over the other, uh, you should only be charging the larger offense. Uh, something that uh, that similarly would apply to would be uh, some of our fleeing and eluding charges. Um, Fleeing and eluding is essentially a, uh, it's, it's a ladder that has rungs from the bottom to the top. The bottom would be uh, disobeying a peace officer, uh, and then the top would be our full-on fleeing and eluding uh, statute, because that includes a reckless aspect towards the, uh, towards the public, right? Uh, however, uh, charging someone with evading and fleeing and eluding doesn't make sense because all of the prerequisites to prove evading are included in the fleeing and eluding charge so you should all you should always just be picking the the largest largest most applicable charge no well, understood thank you there chief chief justice sorry chef the, uh... The, the other thing that I wanted to address with you all is uh, we have seen a rash of reports that have uh, been come in under a few uh, that have been completely and utterly blank. Um, absolutely nothing in the report body, absolutely nothing in the evidence section, absolutely nothing under the individuals involved. Um, upon a closer analysis of one or two of these, I noted that what had been transpiring was that it appeared to be a larger situation where multiple individuals were arrested. Uh, so let's say you have a store robbery and two, two suspects are apprehended. Uh, the first would be processed by Officer A, and Officer A would write a fully detailed report as to the apprehension of those individuals. And the second would be processed by Officer B, and they would write absolutely nothing uh, in the body of their report. Uh, there needs to be a bare minimum of information for the judiciary to review. Uh, something along the lines of refer to report number 851 or 
you know, under persons involved list the other individual who was arrested and then, you know, next to their name put that they were an accomplice. Uh, if I receive a report on my docket that is completely and totally blank, I don't care what the circumstances are. I am going to grant that appeal and we will dismiss those charges. Uh, very simply put, if it is not worth 15 seconds for you to write a singular <laughs> sentence within a report, it is not worth several hours of my or my attorney's time to figure out why you didn't do that. I agree. Hey. So, uh, yeah, just going forward, write a sentence, let us know where we can find the information, um, and that will keep your cases from uh, summarily being kicked off the docket. I've already done it to four cases, uh, you know, from high-ranking members of this police department. I will certainly continue to do it to further blank reports that come across my desk. Do your reports. Um, one other thing, we have started adding officers to the docket uh, so that they can view the status of ongoing matters. Uh, this is currently being done on an ad hoc basis. I believe Captain Valentino, Chief Harper, uh, Officer O'Connor, and a few others have been attached to dockets that they currently have ongoing. Uh, this is for observational purposes, largely. Uh, do not submit any motions or any additional information or anything along those lines unless you're specifically requested to do, to do so by your counsel. Um, so whoever it is that's representing you, if it's criminal, if it's the attorney general, or if it's a civil matter, you know, whoever your attorney is, uh, if they ask you to write you know, an affidavit or something along those lines and post it to the docket, obviously you can do that. Um, but this is an official docket of court proceedings. We're not particularly interested in the uh, ongoing commentary of uh, individuals who are a witness or an arresting officer there too. The reason we're adding you guys is so that you know what's going on, not so that you can uh, chime in on the process. Okay. Uh, outside of that. Oh, sorry, go ahead, sir. No, I was going to say, outside of that, we're not really looking at any major updates uh, coming up. So Chief Harper has asked that we put together some sort of seminar or uh, Q&A section, I think. Uh, but I'm still waiting on scheduling on that from her. So, uh, Yes, Norway. What does the Q and the A stand for? Oh, my God, Norway. Uh, questions and answers. All right. Kuna. He's, he's not very smart, sir. Well, Maybe. I mean, it, I mean, he at least asked a question, so. That is true. Good on yep. you, Norway. Yep. All right, well, uh, I just want to say I, I do understand the, uh, the the workload that you all are under. Like I said, I have seen the volume of reports that go through. Um, Personally, I do not let the small number of uh, appeals and court cases that we have had filed uh, dissuade me from thinking that you all are doing your absolute best to serve our state. Uh, so thank you for your service. And if you think of any questions in the meantime, I will be hosting office hours in approximately six and a half hours at the courthouse. So. That's good news. Hi, thanks, thanks, thanks for thank coming, you. sir. Absolutely. Thank you for clearing up all those things with the stuff and the things in the penal code. Thank you, Chef Justice. Thank you for your service. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, thank you. All. Uh, I know you mentioned trees there. Okay. Does anybody the, uh, have any other concerns that they want to bring up? I understand this has been a pretty long-winded uh, meeting, but uh, you know, that shit is necessary. I hope you wrote all that down and we'll be on the exam. That's right. That oh, shit. Exam. I knew uh, it. Like I said, uh, one of these uh, one of these days, I will announce uh, a proper boot camp that will, you know, uh, be happening. It will in involve uh, an assortment of life-threatening uh, activities that you will all need to participate in. So just keep your eyes and ears open for that. It will include running, jumping, so uh, shooting, man, pepper spraying, punching, hitting, fuck. tackling, okay. all that sort of thing. Okay. All right. Anyway. Uh, until then, I don't think there's anything left to do and or say. Uh, I, I got I got one thing oh, okay, I want to announce. Right. Yeah, go ahead, Sergeant. 
All right. Well, this is uh, may come as a bit of a surprise to some of you. Uh, but pending a conversation with Harper, I uh, will be taking a leave of absence. And uh, I'm going to be putting my bid in for, uh, for mayor. So I hope some of you, uh, hope some of you, uh, you know, can uh, see You the have my vote, Sargam. Thank you. Thank you. No way. You know, I'm uh, I'm not too happy with the current candidates and uh, not sure what the future of the force would be with them. So uh, I want to do this for the force as well as okay, setting a good precedent to, as to what a mayor should on. be in the city and make sure they don't uh, have too much okay. power going forward. Okay. So, Pending in that conversation, I will be uh, you know, stepping down for a bit and... Oh my god, we that. lost another one! Oh, all right. Nope. Yeah, that's good to hear, Dan. What can we do to assist you there, Sergeant? I'll be uh, I'll be getting some posters made and uh, you know getting signs up everywhere I can. Uh, I'll let you guys know if uh, I need any help with that. If you'd like to help, but uh, I appreciate that. This is uh, the big decision I spent a lot of time thinking last night about, and uh, I uh, I just want what's best for the city, and I think this is probably the best way to go about that. Yeah, no way. I have a slogan for you, Dan. All right, I'm listening. Vote for Dan. Dan's your man. Vote for Dan. Dan's our man. If he You're can't do it, no one can. Thank you. Thank you, no way. I'm a tit. Great. I'm a tit. You're a tit. Woo! <laughs> but uh, I wanted to, uh, you know, at least let my family here know first before uh, you know, the announcement got out there. So. Appreciate everything uh, we've done, and you know this isn't a goodbye. I hopefully I uh, will back to the force if everything goes to plan after my term. Uh, yeah, Poppy, you got a question? Oh, would you like um more poster? Would you like a different uh? Would you well, like we'll a different slogan? We'll make a different one. The undoinkable, I think, is probably. But I really uh, think that you would help unfuck the city. It's really good. Oh. It, it is pretty good. We'll talk. We'll talk about okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, sir. Uh, Mr. Dan, um, would you need a theme song for your campaign? I think there might be someone that starts us banging. Whoever has a ninety-five. Who has a ninety-five oh, in the cells? Flynn, go, go get that. Yep, phone. I'm gonna go deal with that. Right. Oh my All god. Right, but, uh, if anyone wants to talk, have questions, uh, I'll be up here for a bit. But, uh, I appreciate everyone. I uh, enjoyed working alongside all of you, learning from you guys. Uh, you know. I hope this is just the next step forward in helping the city become a better place. You've got my vote, sir. I vote for Dan. Dan, sir, right. man. Thank you. I think y'all are dismissed. Why I'll be up in the break room. Oh, wait, 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 Daisy, oh, right. Daisy, wait. Go ahead, yeah. Daisy. Hold on, don't guys. move. We've been dismissed. No, don't. Yeah. Hop don't and get back up front. Yeah, go on there. Sorry, Daisy. <laughs> just check the flyer on your way out, I guess. But, uh, come on, Daisy. Uh, I already on, checked Daisy. it. Yeah. Boxing match for bonding experience on the 8th. 1 p.m. Eastern. If we have problems with somebody, let's work it out in the ring. Really getting me excited for it. Whoa! It's fine. You're dismissed. Uh, oh, I was looking for uh, talk about Alicia Jones, but none of the two officers are here. You got my vote, Marino. About that. She was just questioning. I think it said, Vote uh, excuse Dan. me, officer? Dan. Yeah? Oh, uh, man. We got a call from Pillbox saying that William White had done a hit and run. Excuse Again? me? Again? Yeah. So, what, kind, uh, okay, Again? what kind of hit and run? I don't think he, I don't think he hurt anybody, but they just wanted us to know that he crashed into something or someone and left. I like, oh, not again. Not a person, just a vehicle. She wasn't entirely clear, but yes. Who, did you get the, okay, did you get the person's name? The uh, individual that's called? very well. My, my oh, ears weren't working very well. I think this person well. might help in the front then. What is your name? Say again. Um, Francesca. About, uh, okay. Francesca, my name is Poppy. Oh, nice no, sorry, uh, I just started I here. Dance, no, it's okay. Oh. It's, a, it's fine. Don't, don't be worried about it. Oh, fuck. Uh, you can call me Frankie. Okay, Frankie. Good morning. 
What have you seen the other camp? Not I'm talking yeah. about offices, not busy. Uh, like everyone's busy. Well, I'm about to try to deal with this one. Um, but I really, I have to deal with something else too, so. Okay. Let me see about my cousin Alicia. I think that he wants to go inquire. About who? I'm sorry. Her name is Alicia Jones. Oh, is uh, where's Alicia? Is she here? Okay, let me see her. What's not? The oh my God, Ali! Oh gosh. Do you need food or anything? I'm okay. Girl, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Dance our man. Go for dance. Dance our man. Okay. That does not work. Who's, who's, it oh. is why we GSR test. It's what? specifically that exact reason is why we GSR test people. Hey, who's seen this? Is? They are passed uh, down for our safety during detainment. Bonnie, so, you got this? Nee, we're letting the cadet process, so, but I was on, I was on scene, please. so if they need clarification, we're, yeah, I we're CGSR yeah, so ba basically, um, um, Oh, I, I only put the, um, I was told to cuff her, but I wasn't told to GSR test her, but we're not sure if anyone has, so that's obviously the crux of the issue. It doesn't matter if you steer test this thing. That's not what she's been charged with. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The lawyer's so, so saying that because... She's, she's, she's a felon searched. being charged with criminal possession of a firearm? Yeah, that's it. If, if you will, I, I'd like, can, can I make the argument? Right. Uh, the argument is that she shouldn't have been searched um, because there was no PC that she fired a shot because she wasn't GSR tested, so there was no PC given. No, 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 what we don't. You mean there was no, no. PC that it, we, she was she was at a shooting? Okay. So there's she no was a victim of a shooting. So yeah. there's no, 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 that's not PC. We need RS, it's a uh, Terry Frisk. We frisk people for our safety. We find a gun, she has a gun. It's not PC, we need it, it's RS. Uh, yeah. Well, there's not what I believe the case to be. Uh, no, it yeah, is. You are wrong. You can, I can search with RS. It is not searching, it is frisking, yes. Are you frisking before medical treatment? Yeah, you, uh, <clears throat> so, sorry, let me... So there's, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll butt in here, hold on. Uh, if there's been a, a shooting and, uh, you know, there's people on scene, uh, for officer safety, everybody's to be patted down uh, because uh, anybody there could be, you know, we are reasonably suspicious that any of them could have been involved with the crime, and it is especially an officer officer safety thing. So they get patted down. If a weapon is felt, then, you know, at, at that point, you know, it, it they become a suspect. They get, you know, uh, tested for gunshot residue at that point. You know, it starts to become probable cause, so on and so forth. <clears throat> anyway, uh, this lady's been down here for quite some time, so uh, whatever we're doing down here, let's uh, do it relatively quickly because we don't want to hold her for too long. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm on the back of that. If, if so, was was they, were they treated in the hospital or were they were they patted down whilst oh, they were oh. on the ground receiving treatment? Or at, at uh, they, they they were they were in the it's hospital. Nothing to do with me. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, they, they they were in the hospital when they were checked. Regardless. Um, it doesn't matter if she is shot because she is not allowed to have a gun because she is a violent felon. Because she is a violent felon, no matter what, we have RS to be patting her down. It is marked on her profile. 
I agree that she's a violent fan. I still don't think she should have been searched. I think she should have been geosarted. She, she is not. She is not searched. She is frisked. It's very important you understand the difference between these two because it's going to be the crux of a lot of the reasons you are down here. Do you understand? Like, so I'm also. I'm not being funny, but I'm not going to GSR someone who's like you know bleeding out with a gunshot wound. Yes. There's but a you'll priority search, system but you'll in place. Them? But it's not. Please, oh, sorry, please frisked, understand frisked the difference. One of those I things is for my safety and, people, and the safety of people in the scene, and the other one is just benefits no one. I'm not saving a life. I'm not protecting anyone doing the GSR test when and someone's got a GSW. Yes. All right, but in this case, we'll be a, we'll probably be a pain in this charge. Um, I'll go speak to my client. What is the I'll, charge? I'll return back. Unlawful uh, position. Currently, it's unlawful possession of a firearm. You are going currently. to lose this case. Okay, that's great. Fine, that's fine. Um, just give her time served and a fine. Yeah. Because she's been here a long time. Yeah, that yeah, was what I, I was, said. Uh, I was but uh, why? Why is, um... is it these lawyers? Uh, you know. I'm putting in the. I'm putting in the bar complaint. Just. No, yeah, there's a, yeah, there's a. I think it's very... it's the same thing. So that if if there is a storm coming, then you return to what you were doing. Yes. It does not matter if there is a meeting happening because if she's been here for 50 minutes, as she has said, then that is extremely just. Reckless on us. That's ridiculous. Also, she has. It doesn't matter if there's a everything. meeting going on. Yeah. Yeah. If, uh, if, uh, yeah, sir, that, meeting is irrelevant. That is that is my fault, sir. Completely my fault. Sorry. I take ownership of that. While she didn't wake up immediately. Tech so is probably just let her out. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't remember coffee. <clears throat> Back here and get on radio and let you know what I hear. Thank you so much. <laughs> Sorry, I actually here's a prosecutor and maybe you know. What? Out it. Sorry, I have to fill out the bar complaint quickly. Did anybody go down to the hospital? Oh no, um, I no. don't think so. Okay. Uh, let me go into the cells. I'll get someone to go now. Thank you. Let me just. I just need to do this because. This guy's horribly wrong. Good morning. Man, wait. So the <laughs> it's this bar complaint. I actually can't. The <sighs> ethics violation, illegal conduct. They're an asshole. Someone try and frame me with uh, what I think were, you know, weapons from a crime earlier. So that was fun. Is it already today or? Yeah, it was earlier.
Uh, two thirty. I'll be seventy six to the court. They're sitting home. Be ten seven. Have a good day, officer. Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. Go back. Go hey, kick back. some ass out there and get a 95, all right? Get those communist bastards, ma'am. Thank you. Disregard. I'll be 76, so the shots fired up on... Is it Vinewood? to change where the whoop whoop sound is. Like make it shift or something. Because if you do the whoop right you can't turn right at the same time you whoop Sure you can. Whoops, turns right. Dispatch from 230. I'm not seeing anybody up uh, at the garage off of Eclipse. Our shit's so underground, we haven't even heard of it. Uh, I'm going to call the scene code 4. 10 4. Going back 10 7. Hello, I'm Slagen. I don't even think that it, oh, Jesus Christ. Who is Mr. Jack, sir? Hello, officer. Is that Hello. Poppy? Yeah, it is. Hello. Hey, Poppy. What's up? Um, are any of uh, are any attorneys around specifically, Kit? 
Uh, no, no, at the moment, none of the attorneys are around. Uh, I know Alice Williams is around. Uh, mm -hmm. She might be over at PD. Uh, she said she was also going to grab some food. Yeah, yeah, no. Okay. Uh, who, who died? I'm sorry, what? Is it this, this poster here? Hi. Do you like any uh, assistance? I... Um, I'm good. I can crawl up the steps. Okay. Here? Yeah, that's been up there for a minute. I don't know who put that down there. I don't that know was who Mr. That... William who did it. Our who? janitor. I don't know who that is. Yeah, he's a pretty sweet guy. Means no harm. No, I don't, I don't know who Mr. Jack is. Mr. Jack, uh, yeah, I I don't know who Jack is either, to be honest with you. Apparently, he's dying. I think he's over at Pillbox Medical, um, <laughs> suffering for his life, but who knows? Never met the man myself. Oh, I see. Okay. Um... Anything else I can help you out with, Poppy? Mm, nope, that does it. Thank you. All right, wish you the best. Uh, dispatch room 230. Did anybody make their way over to pillbox? Who do you think? Hello? Ready to attack? Want my gloves? Fuck that one, though. Two thirty, twenty three pillbox. Stepping out the vehicle. Ten four. Now the answer. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Oh shoot. Normally I have ice cream. 
I'm sorry. Oh no, I'm good. Okay. I'm good. Sorry that happened. It's training new people. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to talk to them later. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. All right. It's just, yeah. It's but, not okay. But well, yeah, I mean, no, it's I not okay. Yeah, just... I, I, yeah, no, it's not okay. That's what I was going to say. It's really not okay. <laughs> You just, uh, you guys just have laws and, I don't know, yeah. procedures that don't make sense sometimes, I guess. Yeah, um, believe me, the, the, the gun law is, uh, I'm going to talk to the Chief Justice about it, um, because I believe you were charged, I've looked at a couple of people, uh, you in particular, and a couple of uh, what is what do you like to be called? Your it's AJ. AJ, but I mean like mm-hmm. you and your friends. Uh, the families. Okay, the families. You, I've talked mm-hmm. to a couple of uh, you guys, and um, you have not done any like major crimes in a very long time. Um, mm-hmm. but we still cannot allow you to have guns. So, and you're just going to continually yeah. get fucked for it. Um. Yeah, so, um, you know, we we are getting shot, but at the same yes. time, we're, we're getting searched, and it's like, well, we're not the ones. Right, right, like, exactly. Uh, so, uh, the Chief Justice is, I'm going to talk to him in maybe six hours, so, because uh, I have a question about that as well, um, because I believe, I think I still have your file on me. It is not just you, I believe it's uh, Russo as well. I told uh, Russo to talk to Kit. I believe you can also uh, mm-hmm. talk to Kit. I believe you might have a pretty compelling case because, yeah, you're only. It, it would be. Uh, let's see. Yeah, the 13th was when uh, you did a violent felony. And that was very much before. Uh, the, that's an argument in place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um... Yeah, I know. If you want to talk to kids, maybe you can be making a case, and, uh... As long as you don't do any other violent felonies, you know? Mm-hmm. You might be allowed to have a gun. I'm not saying it will happen, but I'm saying that, um, I understand your situation. Right, okay. Um, I'll keep it in mind, for sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Mm-hmm. Alright, um... Did, uh, somebody call about William White earlier? Go back to the house? Yes. Yep. Uh, he, um, got upset about something that someone said and, uh, deliberately backed up into, uh, one of our EMT's ambulance, uh, pretty hard, and then drove off. After uh, also threatening a doctor and another EMT, and then, as I mentioned, you know, ramming his bike directly into one of the EMT ambulances. Okay. Which, uh, considering his suspended sentence for vehicle manslaughter. Okay, you take care and stay safe. Okay, um, what, what direct witnesses do you have? And do you have the ambulance at this damage? What car was he driving? Uh, let's see. It's right it outside. was his bike. He was driving. I will get Drake. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Two, four, six, uh, yeah, ten, ten. Two thirty. Could I get an additional at the hospital to take statements, please? Four, six, seventy-six. Thank you. Let me just see. I'm unsure if it was this one or the yellow. Let me just check. Yeah, he had banana one. Alright, well, I don't see the damage anymore. There's a, yeah, back into it at least. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I'm not seeing any damage. Sorry we couldn't get here sooner. Um... Yeah, no, that's uh, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, but yeah, Nathan, uh, the doc- uh, doctor, he witnessed it. Uh, also, one of our EMTs, but they're currently out. Okay. Mm hmm. Do you wish for us to send them down for a statement later? Or? No, I have I have no Okay, Ooh. so 
Is anybody injured? Uh, we have one that just came in. No, no, no. I mean, was anybody injured in the incident? Oh, was anybody injured? Uh, no, no. Okay. Was there anybody else that heard the threats towards the doctor? I believe it was uh, Hardy Jackson and uh, Nathan Drake. Nathan Drake, yeah, those two. Uh, correct me if I am wrong. They're both uh, campaigning for mayor. Is Drake campaigning yes. for mayor? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. I, think they all do. I believe he had. What is your name, ma'am? I'm sorry. Uh, Michelle. Michelle Young. Okay, Michelle. And uh, what is your position here? Dispatch. Okay. Yeah, well, we have officer input when you're done, please. Uh, sure. Huh? Uh, and so who who else saw you that? Stand right there. Face, you face you face I would have please, to ask. Please leave the scene for right now, sir, in purple. Oh, oh. Okay. Oh, shit. This, please, sir. This one's dangerous. Okay. But we're not near a police car. All right, so Ooh. I wasn't there personally. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm just relaying information for those yeah, who you. were who are not here currently. But what I can do is I can go back in and see if there was indeed anybody else, because uh, that would definitely help. <laughs> yes. Because it doesn't look good that they're both campaigning. Yes. I see that. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. I'll um. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll get back to you on it. Oh, there's Nathan right there. Yep. Okay. What What the hell is going on? Hold on. Can you take a statement, Norway? I'm going to deal with this purple, purple fucker. This, this oh, doctor. Hey, right. Okay. What is going on here? Why are you near my car? Oh, how are you? My oh, friend no, told you, me to this surrender. Guy needs... Yeah, he what needs to be do? taken in. I don't He's know. He probably women's knows. clothes in fucking uh, clothing store. It's not Why good, man. Why are you making a plan about me the You what now? I haven't... No. He's, he's making up... Stop making honest. up lies about me! Just be honest to the to the lady. I I I am you're the one lying. Sir, why do you think you need to be arrested? I don't know. My friend told me I need to be arrested, so I came to surrender. Why why? He's a danger. I don't He's know. a danger. Why is he a danger? Look at him, is he not a danger? He doesn't look like a dangerous armpit smell. Put your hands down. No, I'm scared! It's kind of rude. He was, you know, stressful situation. He's but kind of sweaty. But He's old, okay. Well, I'm, I'm Is that a lawful of... order? Yeah. If I put Listen, my arms order... down, you might think I have a weapon or something. I'm scared. Do you have a weapon or something? I told oh. you he's a danger. What the fuck we is that? Well, oh my so god. Okay. Sure. Nope. Okay. See? See what happens when I, when I put my arms down? Okay, now no. I'm going to fucking pad you down. Why did you pull that out? <laughs> Listen, for the safety of all of our people, you know, it's problem. The, the only... What is this other bold I feel here? This, why? This other oh, what? Of, okay, I'm, fishing rod, fishing rod. Okay. You That's know. a fishing rod in your pants. Sir! Well, it's folded what? up. Yeah. Sir! Why? Why are you like this? I'm in the prime! What do you mean? Elmer didn't do anything! I've been trying to answer that question since I've met him, I will not lie. Okay. Well, can you go meet him somewhere else? Because I have to deal with this other situation. Ay, bleh, yeah, good luck. Yeah, I'll fucking take him. Okay. Come here, old man. Let's go, you geriatric fuck. Okay. Thank you. Bye. It seems to me oh, like God. he's got an issue with the government. Puppy. He uh -huh. certainly has an issue with you guys as PD. Of course he does. Oh, you miss I mean, puppy. he's a kept killer. After all. Yeah, I don't understand, you know, that kind of hostility or anger, but Do you feel better, some people just want to hear that they watch the world burn everything. now, don't they, Norway? I'm very yep, tired. Yep. They want the world to burn. I want it to be a shining light, and I think you would be an excellent uh, choice for mayor there, Jack. Come, did you well, not I appreciate see? that, Norway. I oh, mean, hopefully I don't uh, the intelligent anymore. people in the city will uh, side oh, with no. you. Make the right choice, because yeah. the city's at stake. Why not vote for Drake, right? Vote for Drake. He's not a fake. That's right. All right. You got a slogan yet? Yeah, why did his weird slogan? Uh, well, the only it? slogan like, um, that I really have is uh, the city's at stake. Vote for Drake. 
on vibes pretty good pretty good yeah you know it's one of those things do the right thing for fuck's sake vote for drake all right there's a lot of sake and drake and for fuck's sake kind of stuff norway you know uh-huh uh -huh. bottom you line is this poster? Uh, you know what? And you want to Keep... bake? Vote for Drake. Well, uh, let's not. No, nah, I don't think baking is necessarily legal, so we don't want to go with that one. No, but bake like bake a bake oh, bread like... or oh, no, like no, bread no, cake but... stuff like that. No, yeah. no, 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 no way can bake. Well, I still oh, God, think no. that some of the citizens might, you know, take that in a whole different direction, Rosie. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I mean, hey, we're there. not There's dealing with uh, you know. Logical Maybe minds for the most part. I mean, you see what we have to deal with on a daily yeah, basis. Oh, Until medicine oh, comes up with a cure for stupidity, uh, we've got way a way lot of job security. I know it happened That's last time. Uh, it's important. Last job security. Time. You want to get rid yeah. of the stupidity? Vote for Rosie. That doesn't well, really. Well, that doesn't even rhyme, Rosie. Oh. Uh. Yeah, you might want to just kind of, you know, maybe uh, look at uh, city council, maybe or. Uh, you might want to just, uh, you know, focus on your career here as a surgeon. Maybe we can get you up the ranks and maybe one Eddie. day you can aspire to be like deputy director or something like that. No, I want, to be, a, I want to be a city council. That would be cool. Well, you know, these things go on and uh, there's going to be another round. I'm kind of, uh, I'm a little What's scared the for that, about by this the way? race. This is going to be the first time that this has happened, so... There's going to be a lot of jockeying for power we'll and a lot of discussions uh, on people that are already up there trying to, you know, get side. more of the power. Uh, I think I might have to go. Oh, need to back up. Hold on. All right. Uh, um, negative right. EMS yeah, would have made a down. call if they needed us. Uh, I, I will be stepping was off the yellow my vehicle over there. to make my way inside. Bush. Yep, give me one second. Okay. Hey, Michelle. Hey, yeah. Okay, so you are using uh, your. Twenty turns out if you might. Uh, you are uh, your antenna too, yeah. That's right, yeah. So um, I don't know if you've ever worked with our dispatch, yeah, because we switch over sometimes. Mhm. Mm Is how long have you been working dispatch? Uh, this is my second. Yeah, about yeah, about two weeks. Yeah. Two weeks. Shit, man. Okay. Um, so, give me a second, my brain just stopped. <laughs> oh, because sorry, when the brain just stopped for a second? I, I hate that. It's just like, my brain, it, it's like I'm laying tracks down, like on a train, and then all of a sudden the tracks just, there's no more tracks, and I have to stop for a second and lace them. Yep. Okay, um, have you ever talked with our dispatch? Uh, Simon, you mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have. Okay. Uh, let me just ask you, um, for like, because we use different 10 codes, so I don't know what to call a downed person, because we call those 47s. Um, 47s the same as for us. Okay, great. Uh, so I know you respond, uh, to 47, obviously. Uh, would you ever want us to also respond? Have a good one. Stay safe, everyone. Uh, to 47s, it, it depends if, I mean, uh, obviously you do if there's gunshots. Well, sure, sure. Uh, but, um, I don't, I don't know, Grant, what do you think about that? It, okay, so we had this incident earlier on as well. Uh, I can't remember the name of the officer. Um, pretty much, for, for 1047s, if you can see that there's not many EMS on, you know, around, that, you know, or it's like a very odd time of the day, or it's very fucking late, and you don't see uh, anybody there? Uh, Bonnie there? By all means, go for him. Okay. If you're right, if you're right there, Radio chair. and there's someone who's a 1047, uh, 10 go for I'll them. And just wait for EMS to come over here. and like we'll help finish them off. I don't see you know, we'll help. Oh, that's a, Never mind. So Let me rephrase that. On. Let's not finish them off. We shall. Uh, we shall. Do you want to use a gun or a knife or? Uh, ah, I'm a golf club. Oh, no, you, oh you were involved in this exactly. scenario um, before. No, no, so we'll then. So the if, arena, right, if you're right correct. there, and you see, you know that. Okay, it's right here. Go for it. Sure, stabilize them. We'll then come over there and take them to the hospital. If you see that there's not many EMS around, there's that sort of time. By all means, pick them up, bring them to the pillbox because you're gonna have to get an answer to them anyway. No way. 
Yeah. Yeah, and also, Ari, if you have a very good idea, if you sense that something is off, they will let me know to contact you guys immediately. And yeah, and also if you see something on the construction site, that's usually not around, but there is now an individual here who had a head Yeah, so we can just go over there and scoop. Well, I'm actually, yeah, that's it's, 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 well, yeah, yeah. I'm actually construction side, like, because we can, we can't, you know, like, help people. Exactly. So, yeah. so we'll let you guys, yeah. Yeah, sorry. So oh, shit, sorry. If there's, yeah, it's fine. So, yeah, if you do see, you know, oh uh, if it's that stupid time in the morning and there's no one around, it's just city you. Yeah, yeah. City Hall. Sorry. Go, 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 go. 30, 46 to City Hall for that shots fired. Uh, 230, we have a biker. You okay? Hello. What's happened? Oh, there was some gunshots. I didn't see who, but I did see some people on a on a motorcycle ride past just before we, the We had people the on motorcycles riding past before the gunshots. Yep, that's right. You are right. Oh, are you your officer? Yes. Yeah, I'm looking for the officer. He said if I say who the bad guy was, I would get a hotel room. And I said who it was in no hotel room. His name is Officer. Hold on. I'm talking to an individual now. I might need 77s, please. No, this is my security guy. He was with me. He, he was just checking it out. Uh, well, CY782 Ace Bishop. He said if I say who the bad guy was, I would get a hotel room, and I don't have a hotel room now, and I don't really like okay. that. Okay, did you shoot them? Uh, no, 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 we were all. I don't up, know up nothing city about holes. that. Okay. Yeah, I just, I just went ahead and uh, circled around a few times trying to look for the suspect, but I couldn't find anybody. Okay. All right. Were you inside at the time, ma'am? We were all inside. Okay. Or they we were, were right outside. Inside, but inside. we were on the steps that were, yeah, they were right, right the front door. So did nobody? And there's nobody entered here? No, it was just the three nope. in City Hall. There is a back door, but... We didn't okay. Anyone and into. there is nobody nobody entered inside, yes? No, ma'am. Okay. I'm not seeing any downed individuals. I did see a couple people leaving on uh, motorcycles. Did they have cuts on? I get they were too far to be seeing. They did look like choppers, though, not a uh, cloud surfer. Uh, what bad guy were you talking about? Well, Ace the Bishop. officer said drug dealers are bad guys. And, you All right, know, I'll be getting back I, inside yes, City please. Hall. Let me know if you need anything. Uh, anyways, the mm -hmm. officer said if I knew who the bad guys were, the I would get a hotel room. When was but this? No hotel room. Okay, when was um, this? What's today? One, two, Sunday or Monday? I don't, I don't remember. I don't have a calendar in my tent, but it was Sunday or Monday, and he said I would get my hotel room. I just got to say who the bad guy is. And if I didn't do it, little chicken, he would throw chicken out the window. Chicken's my only private <laughs> in this world. I just want to make sure that, you know, chicken is okay. And he's not going to get thrown out the window and I get my hotel room. Okay, if I see Bishop, I'll talk to him, okay? Okay, well, thank you. Mm-hmm. And if you officers ever need your cars clean, you let me know. Coral cleans cars. Five dollars is nothing. Okay. Right. I'll pull over for a sec. 
Odd. I'll pull up down the road. Yeah. up there Papa. um yeah so i only saw the one i think it was a chopper couldn't see cut um <sighs> white is going around apparently maybe threatening other pol uh Info. police candidate yeah i can't hear radio so no mm. sorry i was just no i saying he's arriving at uh davis with the 95. what the fuck he get the 90 what the hell uh, from the shooting scene before Storm at, at the arena, one of them had a headache, and uh, I, I told oh. I, I said I had nothing to do with it. I have no idea of any of the context. The only one who might know is Tex in Norway, so I got Norway to go down there because Tex wasn't responding to radio. I have a bad feeling about today. Just, just a. Oh, why is that? I don't know, I just got a bad feeling about today. Oh, you know why I have a bad feeling about today? Why is it? We have three fucking officers on duty. <laughs> I think we should be just fine. Where in the hell did everyone go? Oh. Well, there wasn't that many on duty to begin with. It was what, uh, Dan, who was going off duty anyway, Tex, you, me, Norway, Flynn, uh, Barney, Daisy, uh, Humphrey. I think where that did, was it. It was nine to start. Tex was on duty. Well, it's not anymore. Okay, Tex is no longer on duty. It right, is you, okay. me, and Norway. All right, that's fine. We'll deal with it. Uh, it'll be all right. We need to start recruiting. Yep. And we're down a sergeant. I have a lot of, you know, people tell me they're interested. In becoming a sergeant or? No, just in general. No. <sighs> yeah, well, I mean, if we have three officers, only two of us are currently FTOs. Norway, I have issues with his FTO, and I think he was FTO in Flynn and left him completely. I mean, let's respond to that. 46 this drug sale. 236 same traffic. Uh, 23. Oh, I have a red vehicle fleeing. I mean, a 38 westbound West Eclipse Boulevard with a red and color photo by an individual in a yellow shirt. Dispatch, you on frequency. A dispatch from 204. A dispatch from 204. Sorry, I was 10-7. Send it. Alright, uh, Papi, can you, you get a plate read for this vehicle? Yeah, no. Oh, sorry, yes. All uh, right, dispatch, so, we're going to need a plate read. Uh, out of there. My name Stand is Joe plate. Rosner, badge number 204, uh, if you want to call Washington. You got a, a name there and identification and papers for this vehicle? Damn. I, I can't hear anything you're saying. This going to be Indigo, milk, Georgia, water, but I don't Niagara. Ah, oh, howdy there, howdy. Uh, Fuck, I can't see this fucking plate! I am Maurice Washington. All right. Hey, Pop, is that you? Indigo. It is. Saffron hey, 78. Yeah, what are you uh, doing? Yeah, f speed in a way. I ain't gonna lie, man. Sorry, I'm, I'm having issues seeing. You're starving to death, and why yeah. are you speeding away from a restaurant? Yeah, 
I need to go to an ATM, man. Yeah. Okay, none of this story makes any sense. What you mean? I need to go to an ATM, get money out, and go get some food. Shit. Yeah, off an atom is just the way that you can't. Except on the vehicle, I cannot see this plate. One second. You are leaving an area with a lot I'll, of cash listen, points and a I'll, lot of food only... to go into an area with no food and no cash points. I only know the cash point up here. There's at the uh, there's a garage. Uh, Cougar Avenue, North Rockford Drive, that's the only one that I know about. Hmm. Is this your vehicle there, Maurice? You uh, just breathed heavy, that's not really an answer. I'm thinking, man. You're thinking, it's a yes or no answer. I'm thinking, player. Shit, I, I don't know what, what to say, man. I listen, I, I, my ass is trying to think out, think about all like the outcomes and shit, depending on what I say. Ah, uh, Maurice, I'm gonna have to ask you to step out the vehicle. <laughs> See you later, motherfucker. You're in an active 80. Heading south. Portola Drive, continuing south, Portola Drive, speed 60, approaching 70 miles an hour. The red and color photo occupied by Maurice Washington. Continuing east on Dorset Drive. He's gaining speed on me. What? North Las Lagunas. He's slowing down, he's stopping. Now. Are y'all gonna give me the fleeing at and eluding charge? Oh. Uh, well, probably yes. Oh, come on, man. Come me some slack and I'll stop. Well, then what? No, now I need to arrest you for your. Okay, I get, get it down to maybe an evading or something. You sure? Yeah. How I know your ass gonna be promised me though? I'll, I'll make uh, sure. Cause I, yeah, I'm always an honest individual. Yeah, oh, I'm here man. too. Man. Pulled over. Know. Listen, oh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, what man. Is I, I, no, listen, on. listen. I'm what thinking, motherfucker. Pockets, there, Maurice? Uh, I got a wheelchair, some cigarettes, a lighter, some beer, some pictures of myself, some notebook pages, uh, and something I shouldn't have. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let me guess. It's drugs, isn't it? No, it's a gun, motherfucker. You have a gun? Is it? Oh my god. Yes, man. Come on. Is it, okay, okay just pull, pull it pull over and move on. Listen, let's over. speak pull about it, it though. Let's pull, speak about okay, it. Okay, let's I, pull we, it we over and move on. Traffic. Pull it over. What you mean? There's a man literally right behind you honking his horn. Yeah, he can the wait. He's flipping you off, Fuck man. you, motherfucker. I'm flipping that motherfucker off now as well. Uh, just, just, just You're negotiating in the middle of the street. Come on, man. Let's negotiate on the side of yeah, the road. Yeah, just pull it over. We'll talk. I'll get you a milkshake. How about that? But I'm scared, though, man. Because I know y'all are going to slap the fucking loot charge back, charge back on no, me. No, look, look, no. Look, look, look. Okay, look. You you drove fast, but actually you didn't drive over the sidewalk, nor did you crash into anything. I can easily push that down to just a, the evade and charge, yeah. which is the lesser. Yeah, that's lesser. What what about the gun? Y'all y'all motherfuckers gonna yeah, have me fucked are, up for the gun are, as well, you're man. You're kind of fucked for the gun, gun. yeah. Yeah, yeah but I need that man. for personal protection. Shit just happened to me, man. Well, Shit. Then you shouldn't have used violent felonies against individuals. You would have kept that right. Socialist. Right, listen, listen, listen. How about I drive myself down to the police station and ha ha myself in? No, you will get what? into How my car. No, 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 no. You get into now? my car. No. Hey, because, because, listen, I want to have a l nice last bit of freedom before I no. go to jail. So I'm going to drive down to the police no. station. Maurice, no. Maurice, how about you get Maurice? Up. No, I, I no. I will turn it into fleeing and eluding if yep. you leave. Hey, hey, wait, wait. I'm turning around, motherfucker. No, I don't want to no, be parked no, in the middle no, of an intersection. No. No, Come on, Maurice. Maurice, you get into my car. Maurice, get into my car. All right, cool. Now put the fucking what? gun. Yeah, it's on the floor. Uh, wait, uh, make sure to search him yeah, first. I don't want right. you to get... Well, okay. Now he's in the fucking car. I didn't. I thought that was locked. Maurice, get out of the car just so I can search you, yeah? Alright, uh, cool. Don't put me in cuffs, though. Come on. I, I'm I, I doing this out got of good faith. I got to search you, though, okay? Alright, cool. Get step let's out, get out, out of the car. car step out of the car. Yeah, let's let's get out of the car. You step out first. Step out of the yeah, car. Yeah, I'm trying, but it's really hard to. I think you're, you're gonna have to drag, drag me out of some nope, shit. No, step out of the car. You can step oh, out of the shit. car. 
No, you're fucking tricks, Maurice. Yeah, I ain't got nothing else on. Alright, hands up, okay. Don't put me in cuffs though, man. Come on, you ain't, you, you ain't gotta do that shit. Yeah, I am surrendering. I'm cooperating. You ain't gotta do cuffs okay, or anything. I'm okay. getting in your car okay. peacefully. Okay. okay. Okay, no, you're stepping in the back right, of my cool. car. No. Yeah, I'm expect second, yep. stepping around in the back. <sighs> you kind of like a car, puppy. Yeah, I did. Wait, wait. Maurice? My God, Maurice. Get in the car. You're gonna unlock this shit again. Marisa! It ain't me, motherfucker! Mar the damn car! There we go. Hell okay, we go. now you have the child locks are on. We're going to the station. Alright, cool. <sighs> 230, 76, Davis PD, 195. Stop hitting the shit, buttons! Turn that shit on for you, Stop man. Stop hitting the buttons! You're actually gonna cut me some slack, though? Yes. Oh, uh, thank you. I do really need some food, though. Jesus Christ, Morris. You shot me, I was gonna be real mad. Stop hitting! <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble for the thing you said in the front. You know this. That's all good. No, it's not, Morris! Oh shit, that actually works. Stop it! Maurice, stop! This is why we hang up people, Maurice! I'm having fun, man. <sighs> this is not gonna happen every time. Next time I'm handcuffing you. Oh, right, cool, that's fair. Okay, you remember this. I'm writing it down. Next time I. Okay. Next time I handcuff you. Goddamn heroes! <laughs> Welcome back! I have to handcuff you to put you in this also. That's a rule. Okay? Yeah, that's cool. Okay, stop, stop. I have to turn off my siren. Stop. Out. You broke it! Oh, shit. Oh my god, Maurice. Shit, my bad. Okay. You like my See, new clothes? But, yeah. I do like your new clothes. Okay. Thank you. Just kidding. I'm just going to escort you. Please stand still. It's all good. I'm walking in. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't gotta escort me. Just open it up. Okay. And this is definitely not because I don't have handcuffs. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. You wanted to sell free. That's my baby. All right, cool. Don't, don't kill me because I don't have handcuffs. Just back home. No, 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 face away from me. Let me just have a quick look. At <laughs> on, yeah? What up? Ah, cigarettes, pages. Uh, all right, you're all good. Okay. You want you want to do me a favor? What's that? You see these pictures? Yeah. You, you want to take a look at them? Wait, let me see what they are first. Shit. All right, that was cool. That one, oh shit. Uh, can't show you that one. Uh, all right. Here, take take a nice little look at that, please. No, I'm, I'm taking all of them now. Yoink. Oh. <sighs> you dumbass. <laughs> listen, listen. I found that in the trash, man. That ain't me. Oh, th these I took these photos of you th on the bench. Yeah, yeah, I know. This this photo of you robbing the commercial uh, area. That with ain't two me, hostages, man. Though that's that's a different story. <laughs> that ain't that ain't me, player. It's different clothes and everything. You always wear that jacket. That is the jacket with the ma uh, the, the the dope leaf on the back. <laughs> you want to show Poppy these pictures? Uh, I don't know if I want to see these pictures, Washington. <laughs> Here you go. Oh no, let me see. All right, since you showed me something incriminating, you want to see something oh, incriminating no. and, and about me? Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here you go. Shit to me. That notebook page, shit.
there. That was not the reaction I expected, but all right. Hey, man, have listen, you, listen, listen. I know your ass got that thing on you. Play your shit. I don't even know how to get have down Have you heard like him do his lady voice? No. Uh, hey, no. listen, listen. Do, listen. Do I'm only doing that shit if my ass is getting time off. Oh, I'll, do, I'll give you some time off. Do your lady voice. What do you want me to say? Uh, I don't remember the script. Do you remember it? No, I ain't got that shit no more. Mm, it was like... Oh, I don't remember the name of the investigative group. No, oh, it was something like, uh... My husband went missing and... Blah, 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 blah. Instead of having gonorrhea, I now just have herpes. Thank you so much, Solomon. Or some shit like that. I don't fucking know, man. Real impressive, he's huh? To, I'm like, real multilingual shit. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Why oh, have man. you been practicing that? Hey, listen, he listen. going to be an actor. I spend a lot of time around the uh, around the female uh, uh, f f females. Oh, oh sorry shit, there, Papa. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Female, just Pop like that. It. Yeah, I was just pointing at the f the female in the room. Hey, listen. Am I am I going to jail? But yes. I just like spend time in here and then just leave. Like, come on, man. Well, just yeah. hit me with, hit me with a fine. I'll sit in here, then I'll leave. I ain't doing no harm. Well, uh, I mean, it would be what? Uh, is it eluding or escaping? Not escaping custody. That's that... a huge charge. Yeah. Um, uh, I, I don't... Just I don't listen, know. listen, listen. Just drop that shit, man. I got in your car respectfully. I hand over the weapon. No contest. You know, yeah. I just had a, a listen. I panicked and had a little bit of la lapse of judgment, but I came to my senses and I spoke to y'all. I was being reasonable and shit. Y'all gotta admire that. Come on, just fucking drop that shit and just get me with this thing in the car and having <sighs> a gun. Okay, so. Unlawful possession of a firearm, that's 35 months, 200, and then the have on the stone. Fuck! Are you alright there, Papa? No, I broke it. I'm gonna appeal not guilty, by the way. However, however. I have to know, take you... a nap. I broke it. Alright. Oh, I will plead not guilty, but you know, you gotta give me my like, mm, Papa. Is Joe dealing with it? Is Joe gonna is Joe gonna deal with it? Deal with what? Morris? But I think so, yeah, we were both in the arrest. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I had to I had to slip.
Welcome back. Hi now. <sighs> okay, so truth be told, I've barely worked and I'm kind of terrified being here by myself doing dispatch. It's okay, we'll walk you through it, okay? Alright, thank you. Uh, if you got any questions, let me know. Uh, everybody on duty right now is very, very, uh... Very helpful. Uh, you're in our filing cabinet, yeah? Yeah, I am. Okay, uh, so the 10 codes... If you don't know the 10 codes, or if you don't know a call, uh, just... Um, uh, just say what the call is. Okay. Uh, I'll do my best. Yeah, that's all you can do. Nothing you, you can do about that, you know, lowering it a little bit or some shit. You gonna plead guilty? Yeah, of course I am, man. If you plead guilty, I'll drop it to 30 months. Oh, uh, 25. Uh, um, that's a 50% reduction. Yeah, it's all good. Hey, listen, listen. You know, I could have kept on driving, you know, kept on driving recklessly, speeding, you know, I could have kept well, that gun on me, all you, that shit. You, you know. could have, you could have, yeah, but exactly, you know, you weren't man. escaping. So, me. you know, I kind of did have to go, man. I you right, but you know, I did half the crime, you know. Are you, are you pleading guilty? Just do it, Maurice. 25 months, come on, man. No, 30 months. 30, 30 months. Tw 27. Maurice, if you really want to argue, I can push all of these up to felony and then we can have a re uh, discussion again afterwards. 28.5? 30 months. Uh, guilty. Guilty, all right. Wait, 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 though, wait, though, wait, though. Let me give Poppy a handshake first. And, and you too, player. Ah, right, give me a second. Let me just. My man. Mm -hmm. Hold it down. My man. Right, here we go. Yeah, that me all right. I'll see y'all uh, later. All right. You're yeah. gonna say hi to my friend. Uh. uh... What's his name again? W Felix. Who? Uh, uh, did, did you hear that I served time in jail? No. Why are you uh, in jail, motherfucker? Uh, well, there was a large amount of officers in here and a large number of suspects. And, and Styles was struggling to figure out who, he, who his, his suspect was. So accidentally sent me up to jail and the DOC <laughs> all came and grabbed me. And apparently me screaming at them, you've got the wrong guy, I'm innocent, I didn't do it. Uh, well, everyone says that, so they didn't believe yeah, me. Yeah, uh, so the reason why they don't believe motherfuckers like that no more is just because of me, you know. The amount of times my ass being up to fucking county and shit, man. The amount of times I be saying yeah. that shit, like, hell no. Nah. Yeah, and they never believed it. But uh, I, I, I was, you know, I was up there for a small amount of months. Officers came and got me after they realized the mix-up. So to survive whilst I was up there, I made friends with uh, Felix. Uh, his his real name's Felice Navidad. Oh, uh, he, he's up there. Ain't, he's a vibe. Don't that mean a happy birthday or like Merry Christmas? Oh, I don't know. I don't speak French. Oh, uh, but <laughs> but uh, he's up there on on life life in jail because uh, he used to jump across home rooftops and jump down their Christ. chimneys and steal all of their oh, worldly possessions. Oh, for real? Oh, yep. And then they tattooed me. Be advised, we have a store Damn. robbery with See? Holy shit. Hey, that's a good tattoo, though. Yeah, it's... Uh, it's uh, I know Poppy got a couple Sa of tattoos. Santa, I, I, no, I, I did not. When she, when she, when she Santa Maria. Through, you know? She doesn't have any tattoos. I do not have I any know tattoos. She hey, she keeps listen, talking listen, to me about hey. how she wants to get one. I want no, to get one. She got a big ass tram stamp on her back. I do not. No, she doesn't. She, I think you, I'm getting you mixed up with Officer Brooks. Probably. Yeah. You, you know me. Anyway, let me get All faded right. and then I'll head up to prison. All right. Anything you want to say before I send you up? Uh, don't do crime. All right. I won't. Goodbye now, Maurice. I'll see, see you soon. Young thug. Love you. Cheers. Yeah, we got the shooting right down the street, by the way. Ah, 
people are robbing stars. I need to write this report. Okay, let's go get shot at. Okay. Two oh four ten eight seventy six back to uh shooting down the road. Two thirty same traffic. Right. Oh have a good one, officer. I'm so sorry, I'm not Good job. Visual of anything, uh, I'll be making my way inside off radio. 230 right behind you. 10 4. Davis Avenue is code for uh, the clerk is dead. I, I swear I heard screaming. Will there be a need for EMS? Uh, no, I think they're just shoveling him into the back. They're rather ruthless. This, this outside. 10-4. We're active here or? On uh, 10 9. We have an active? Uh, negative. There was just a stall robbery at uh, Grove and Davis. Uh, shots fired. We arrived on scene. No suspects. Uh, clerk was dead, being actively shoveled into the bag by, by, by the owners. It's all code 4. 230, 76 back to Davis. Went to work with dispatch for a little bit. Jesus Christ! Hey, welcome by. Hey, thirty. Ten it. So you guys greet them, and when they leave, you go, uh, "Good luck." Stop. So mechanically, how do robberies work? Uh, they go in, they point a. Uh... Oh my God, I am fucked today. Uh, you go in, they point a gun at the clerk. The clerk puts their hands up, usually. And, um... Then they start shouting numbers. Usually. I don't know, I thought I heard yelling. Okay. Um, so another thing you're going to want to try to pay attention to, um, is, uh, if you look on the screen here after you hit the letter T. Okay. Do you see that, um, there was just an armed Grand Theft Auto on Red Desert Ave? Oh, okay, yes. Uh, so when you do this, uh, what is useful information to give is the... God, I need to change my push to talk. Is the, uh... Uh, uh, the license plate ending in 534. Okay, and, uh, does this come up, like, on the regular alerts? No, it does not. So you kind of have to just check it every once in a while. So, especially after things like, if you get a chop shop call, um, if we get a chop shop call, uh, pay attention here. Right. Um, because people will often chop their cars, um, and then try to steal another car. Okay. So or if we lose, then... or if we lose, sorry. So you can say, you know, PD from dispatch, uh, be advised that there is a carjacking off of Red Desert Ave. License plate ending in whatever the number was. Um, 
make and model of the car is uh i don't know what that car is i'm very bad at cars fuselade yeah a fuselade uh black i would really really like to get a a copy of the catalog at pdm but even the catalog at pdm does not have all of the cars that are available oh really yes so Also, radio check. Can you hear me there? Yes. You did. Can you oh, run no. the radio? Hold on. Uh, uh, say that one more time. Radio check. Oh. No, I can hear um like that you're engaging with it, but I can't right. hear your voice. Right. So you cannot you cannot look at the map and talk at the radio at the same time. Oh, okay. So just be aware of that, because that caused a huge issue yesterday. Okay. Um, have you been? So are you dispatch or are you front desk? Because this is a different. I'm issue. I'm dispatch. Okay. So um. Uh, has Simon kind of you've worked with Simon before? Um, not really. I basically got hired and then I stayed for a couple hours after I got hired. But there was not really anyone here, so I haven't even really been trained yet. Okay. Um, so, like, the most important things you will be doing is um, when somebody is calling for dispatch. Um, so, it will be, like, dispatch from 2.30. Can I get the plate read? Do you know how to do uh, look up plates? Yes, I do know that. Okay. So, and when we are looking at plates... Um, Typically, if it's beginning with um, I, G, N, you, it will always be coming back as stolen. Um, okay. So, because those are always going to be local cars. It is always going to be stolen, or it is also going to be... Uh, it is possible that it is rented. But you can look at every car in the street. Now, if a vehicle... Uh, let's go out to the lots real quick. So. You see, like my license plate. Right. Um, because this is a company car, it's going to start with IGN, but it's a local okay. company car. It's not my personal car. Taxis, also this, um, you know, so it's important to, you know, distinguish construction vehicle, also this. Basically, anything not from PDM will have this kind of plate. Okay. That understood. makes sense? Mm -hmm. So, otherwise, they will have this kind of plate. Capitalizing all of the letters, very important, and also putting the space. People will not say the space when they are giving you the... the, uh... the license plate. So just right, know so it just is there. know it. Yeah. Because they are always like this. So it's going to be three letters, space, three numbers. Okay. You can... Is there a car on here? Yeah, it sounds like something's on. What's this on? Oh, it's this bike here. What the heck? Oh, it's broken. So, yeah. Um... And then if, um, not that you would ever need to know this, but if, uh, an officer's ever, like, pulling over a bike like this one, right? Mm -hmm. <sighs> like this one, or that one has one. So, like, this one doesn't have a plate, right? Um, right. they can, uh, like, bend down and, uh, look under the, 
F4 uh, metal plate here. And uh, they can see what the plate is. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's good to know. Yeah. I think you can actually do that too. Um, yeah, you can. Um, if you want to look under the F4 uh, plates there. I mean, you shouldn't, but you know what I mean. Just so you, if you have to ever describe it to an yeah. officer, because officers are stupid! Yeah, I see it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Um, were you talking about uh, when vehicles are seized? No. Okay. So, this is, trying, this is something that I am uh, trying to streamline. <sighs> when the uh, Officers are seizing a vehicle, um, either in the reports, but that's kind of difficult. Um, when they are seizing a vehicle, um, it goes into our database up here. Now, do not... You can look at this, but do not select anything because it will release the car. Okay. So you just want to, you know, kind of, when you're looking at that to exit it, you just want to backspace out of it. Okay. So when people's vehicles are seized, we can only seize them and fuck, I meant to say this at the meeting, but I woke up late. And then the meeting ended weirdly, um, without somebody said that we were dismissed and before, does anyone else have any other announcements? We can only seize vehicles, um, for a certain amount of time, not a, not, um, this is mostly for officers, but in case an officer ever, like, kind of needs it, um, we can only seize vehicles for a certain amount of time, uh, not until, like, their fine is paid. So, uh, and I usually make notes, um, on where, like, on their profile. Um, I can't think of somebody that has their vehicle seized right now. But on their like little notes section, I usually make a note that says when their vehicle can be released. Okay, that's helpful. Mm hmm Because it, it lessens the work, I feel, for you. Uh, having to go through, like, every report. Right, so if someone comes in, I can just ask their name, look it up, and mm -hmm. uh, see it right there. Yep. Uh, it's an extra step for people, but... Actually, it's probably easier to do it on, uh, like, a license plate search for a car, but this is something I need. we need to meet with the other, just to streamline everything. But, you know, the department is uh, on fire constantly, so. Is it? Oh, yeah. Usually there's oh. a lot more people around right now. That that's concerning. Oh, it's fine. Yeah, they they didn't they did say something about animal deaths when I got hired. Oh yeah, don't have your pets in here. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So. Yeah, if you go into the, uh... Ah, we should be adding it here. Um, so every... Blah, every vehicle profile has something. Uh, what do you mean by ha has something? So do you have a car? I don't. Okay, so you can look up my name, P-O-P-P-Y. I 
And then okay. if you look up uh the license plates ending in four ninety nine. Do you see the uh the vehicle information there? Yes. Okay. Um, there's a note section there. I might tell people okay, to start putting it there instead. Yeah, I think that would work well, and then they can just give their license plate over and then find it that way. Mm-hmm. Um, however, you see, I just added it. Do you see it's a stratum and then the color of it? Mm-hmm. Now, if you go back and you look up my other car... one that's ending zero three one mm -hmm. this is how it normally is the model and the color are not there so you have to fill that in yourself yes. so would it be helpful let's say someone came in and they asked for information about their car, and I happened to see that the model and color weren't there. Um, would it be helpful if I asked them what the model and color were and added them? <clears throat> yes. Sorry, I was thinking about toast. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Yeah, this is something that I think would be helpful. I have been doing it. Um, you know, today I might... Because... Because there's not a lot of um, officers on duty. I think uh, the locks get extra secure on a lot of things. Mm -hmm. So it I might be, actually... Uh, good day for paperwork. Yeah, so I think I might actually uh, try to write a bunch of stuff down. Well, let but me know also, if you need help with yeah, anything. But also a good day for learning, so. Paperwork day? I'm surprised how quiet it is. Okay. You get one. Oh, what did I do? You get one. What, what did I do? You said the Q word. Oh, we don't use that word? Nope. Oh, okay, let me note that one down. No Q word. Try using. I'll never use it again. Peaceful? peaceful. Serene? Get the thesaurus. Oh, also, if you are bored, um, there are uh, stuffed cats hidden around in the station. I believe there is like five of them, one of every color. Hidden? Why? For fun. Oh, well, you should nice. find you should find all of them before construction happens. Oh, yeah, should I should also learn the penal codes. Okay, what do you want to know about the penal code? I can teach you. Um, well, I just really need to read them and like learn just what like what they are. Okay. Uh, yeah. So you know what the you know what the penal code is generally, yeah? Because it's just the charges. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, I, if you have any I, I questions. About it, just be letting me know. Because I know the, yeah, the I things I know will. the best is the... I read a lot. So I'm like... Reader. And... That kind of paperwork person. The thing I do not know, yeah. I'm not a... I'm not a... Chase person. 
I'm a paperwork yeah, I, and people I, I, I person. I understand that. Yeah. <laughs> so. I like paperwork a lot, too. I just never, um, you know, like my dad was a, he was a sheriff, but um, he, he didn't like me, you know, learning things like that. Oh, I see. I just read by myself. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. But but now um now I can learn about them so I I'm going to. Yeah, go ahead and give them a read over. If you have any questions about any of them, uh, be letting me know. Also read over the Constitution because I think a lot of people are not going to be reading over the Constitution, and that is extremely important to be reading over. Yeah, no, that makes sense, um, especially for officers. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. And fucking lawyers. I almost I was going to slap that lawyer upside the head. Yeah, we're going to contest that she had a gun in court. Even though she had a fucking gun. Sir. Well, that doesn't make sense. You're stupid. Please, save yourself. I know not well, all lawyers I mean, are bad. I, I feel like that would be pretty obvious for a judge to look at and say, like... Well, hey, no. Yeah, I was going to fill in the bar complaints because he's just... But there's not a... Your lawyer doesn't understand the law complaint. Maybe put that on... Well, there is a... He's an asshole. But there's not a... He's an idiot. Yeah, that's all. They probably should add that. Yeah, I think I, I would like to fill a bar complaint for the bar complaints form. Now I'm just imagining endless complaint forms. Maybe I'll do that today, too. If you would like a stupid complaint form, please let me know, and I will just fill out the stupid complaint form. You know, we could probably use one of those. We will just get too many complaints. Yeah, true. You know, it's funny, like, people come in, like, 40 times a day asking about employment. And, and we're not hiring, but, like... I know we are not hiring. But, like, Ugh. look... That is above my pay grade. How long have you worked here? Um, a little over a month now with a week sabbatical. Okay, so you've been here a little bit. Yeah. Do you like it? I, I love it. I really, I've never done this kind of work before, and I didn't have any family that did this kind of work before. Uh, so. Something new. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've done work with, like, paperwork before, but I've never done, uh, you know, this kind of work with paperwork. And by work with paper, Mark, I mean, like, uh, sorry, I mean, just reading. I never, this is my first job. Sorry, can you say that again? I said, this is my first job. Oh, me too. Nice. Yeah. And it's my first time uh, having to be shooting people. And I'm pretty okay at it, so. Well, that's, I guess, a, <laughs> uh, I guess a useful skill for you guys. Yeah. I I've never held a gun. I don't want to. Oh, I mean, it's useful. When you're getting shot <laughs> at. Oh, yeah, definitely. If you're, But I, I'm hoping that, you know, I, I don't get shot at. Mm, it happens sometimes here. Yeah, I heard about a box incident. Oh, yeah, that was Maurice. That's the guy we just was sending up in the back. He's... 
it's actually not that bad. I know he he did try to shoot somebody, but he's he's complicated. Pretty sure he's in love with me. Oh. Yeah. Well, you you should you know just be careful. Oh yeah, I know, I know. I'm pretty careful. I don't think he would ever... Well, I made him cry in these cells, so... Made him cry? How did you make him cry? I said, Maurice, imagine if you were shooting me. How badly would you feel? I'm pretty sure he was cried? just... I'm pretty sure he was just bullshitting. But he did plead guilty, so... Either way, I win. Well, just don't, you know, don't, don't trust him too far. If he shot an officer, you know, that's, that's someone who's very dangerous. Oh, if he ever shoots me, that's, that's the end of him. Yeah, if he ever shoots me, yeah, he is, he don't is. Don't get on Poppy. <laughs> I, I pepper sprayed somebody in the face the other day and they, they still play guilty to me <laughs> about as far as you were standing from me they would not put their hands up that that sounds very painful yeah well, they wouldn't put their hands up so I pepper sprayed them in the face well yeah I think I think that's fair given what you have to do yeah hi hey how are you here to pay a fine? Uh, I, I was just making sure I didn't have any. Oh my god, I thought that was okay. Deuce for a second. Thanks. Deuce! Hold <sighs> hold How you doing today? I'm doing all right. How are you? I'm doing so good. I just bought myself a cur. Oh, congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Is it's it your first cur? Yeah, it's my first cur. Wow, that's huge. Thank you, thank you. It's, I bought myself a nice book Chev. A Chevrolet Capress. Have you been able to drive it around yet? Yeah, I parked it in the garage. Oh, nice. Yeah. So what's going on here? It's kind of, we're kind of. Don't say. Oh, sorry. So say what? Oh, oh yeah, we're not. Don't gonna, say the Q word. Say that word. What's the Q word? Don't say it. What is the Q word? Uh, it also means like peaceful, silent. Don't say it though. It's oh, it's awfully not loud in here. Yep. Okay, I'm going to. I'm. I'm starting to. Um. Make. What do you think the officers are the least good at, Norway? Probably dealing with lawyers. <sighs> I don't know how to write stuff for that. And people uh, seem to toss around this PC RS thing constantly, but uh, to be honest, I haven't really seen anyone struggling with this concept firsthand. I've seen people struggle firsthand with RS and PC, but that's something like I don't think I can write. I'm uh... thinking. I'm thinking about paperwork, right? Like. Oh yeah, writing reports. Yeah. Yeah, they, everyone. It's a lot. Uh, even up, 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 up there in the office that uh, don't have a uh, really good paperwork. So how to title reports, right? Yeah. So name a suspect, biggest charge, date. Uh, and then also uh, for seizing cars. Uh, we can, oh, actually, I need to talk to you. Um, we cannot seize cars until they pay their fines. Uh, that's something we're not able to do anymore. Um, we can only seize cars for a certain amount of time. I never did that. 
Okay. Uh. Well. Uh, I seized them and then they could like I've seized two vehicles I believe and one could come back if he uh, gave some nice compliments to the person working the front desk then they could have it back. Uh, unless it's like really serious, you know, then. Uh, but uh, we should be able to like uh, seize, not just seize, but like seize for, and then like maybe uh, days. Yeah. So I usually do it for a number of days at officer discretion. <sighs> okay. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, ba, I need ba, a boombox in here. No, no. I really like the queue. Okay. That's nice for a change. I'm pretty sure all the locks get a lot tighter when there's not enough officers around. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to run up to the break room for a couple. Okay. No. No? No. Why? Just kidding. It's a yok. It's like yoshing okay. around. Okay. Like okay, a little bit of right. FS humor? Where's yeah. your sense of humor? I, I've been joke? told I don't have a very good sense of humor. I apologize. Why? Oh, <laughs> I'm going to go take a break. I'll be back. Enjoy your break. Don't stop me now. Sorry. Oh. I cannot find a woman like that. Oh, wait, no, this is an f up song, right? Okay. 
And then make like an employee handbook, right? So here's the question. Do I continue? I'm going to slap you! All right, I'm going to get out there. I'm going to give you public disturbance. No, 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 no. I'm out of here. I'm not, des I'm de-escalating. Let's cool it up your ass! God damn it! Okay. Hello. Hi. Uh, I'm looking for Cole O'Connor or the Chief Harper. Nope. nope. Either of them. Nope. Where are, are they just on duty? Nope. It's just me. You're the only one here today, Poppy. Yeah. Poppy, where is everyone? I don't know. Poppy, what, what happened? I don't know. <laughs> well, if you're the only one left, that means you had to have killed everyone else, Poppy. I didn't kill anybody. Poppy. I didn't kill anybody. Well, yeah. then where are they? I don't know. It's just, it's just me. It's just me in the office right now. Uh. uh okay. It's me, it's Norway, and, uh, Washington. Seriously? Yeah. Poppy, that's insane. I know! I'm... I, I don't okay, know where everybody well... is! Um, well, I... I guess I'll come back then. Uh-huh. Every time I come here, nobody is here that I fucking need. Damn it. Well, yeah, I, I need people too. I need literally anybody. I'm sorry that you're here alone. Well, it's okay. I mean, we do have a dispatcher, but she's taking a break. She's a new dispatcher, so I'm teaching her. But, oh. Yeah, so. But you know, we're, we're still not hiring. So, so you know. Oh. Yep. I see. Because was yeah. there even a meeting today? There was a meeting. There were people at the meeting, and the the chief justice was here. So, uh, Did something happened at the meeting where maybe people were like, "Fuck this! I'm going 42." Uh, the chief justice was here. They didn't like that. I don't know. I mean, the chief justice like described the penal code, and I I don't know if anything else happened. Oh. I don't know, we're losing a lot of high command at the moment. Oh, well, oh uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you only have Harper left, right? Well, Enzo's still around. Yeah, Enzo's still around, um, but uh, Dan is stepping down. What? Why? Uh, he's running for mayor. Jesus Christ. Yeah. So I don't know if that's a, I don't know if that's a fleet at some people's, uh, I feel like that should inflate people's morale. Then, oh. you know, more jobs open. Yeah, but we've had nobody's... None of the positions have been filled. That They're just... You know. There. I don't even know why I bother anymore, Poppy. Ah. Uh. I mean, I'm not the solo cadet anymore, so that's that's great. Okay, congratulations. Thanks. But you need a team. Yeah. Um, like, I'm trying to work on FTO stuff, but um, there's no... There's uh, no one here to FTO. There's no one here to FTO. Well, you kind of me a little. Yeah, I'm FTO in the dispatcher. <laughs> God. I told her how to do traffic stops. 
That's good practice. That's good practice. Hey, good. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, and so just in case you need to know this, because, you know, she will need to know the other end for doing a traffic stop. And I guarantee fucking to you, the, the, the cop that's going to do the traffic stop whenever I'm not around is not going to know how to do a fucking traffic stop. <laughs> I... Everything's great. Yeah, cool. Yeah, um, it's super great, super great. Okay, well... How's your um, life going? Good, I think I'm about to be promoted. Oh, great. Yeah, but, Oh, I went, you know. I went to put in a bar complaint earlier, Um, but the option of this lawyer's a fucking idiot wasn't there. On who? Uh, the grenade. What does that mean? That's a, that's the, the lawyer's name, Paul. His name is Paul the Grenade? Well, I don't know his last name. It's like Paul the Grenade. I don't remember his last name. I will figure it out. But What's he look like? He has glasses. I think he was in the wheelchair for a little bit. Oh, Paul. I know yeah. him. What did he yeah. do? Um, He was saying that we did not have the right to frisk somebody and find a gun. And therefore, we should not be charging her for having a gun. And he said, "You're this is, you're stupid." He said that to you. <laughs> I well, said, "Can't she's, say that." But no, I no. He I said you. I, I told him he was stupid. He did not say that we were stupid. Sorry, I uh I told oh, him he was okay. stupid. Yeah, because she Good. was on the she was on the scene of a shooting. We frisk her. We find a gun. She's a violent felon. Uh, she's not supposed to have a gun. That's it. Yeah, I mean, if she's on scene of a shooting, there's yeah, your that, RSIPC it. right there. Exactly. And she, he said, no, I don't think you have PC to be frisking her. And I said, no, you're, you, no, you're wrong. <laughs> he said, I don't think I'm wrong. And I said, no, I know you're wrong. You need to read. You need to Problem read. What was this? Uh, at the beginning of Storm today. Wow. Yeah, I said, you're wrong. He said, well, I'll take it to court. And I said, you're going to look like an idiot because you, you're not. It's literally Terry versus Ohio. Like, you're. This is it, you. This is the only charge she's contesting is having a gun, and she has a gun. Yeah. Well, I mean, good luck to him in court. I'll be there for you if it goes up there. Yeah. It's uh, and the thing is, it's the client. I don't even think was like that pissed about it. She, he was just making it difficult for himself. That's what they like to do, you know? Yeah. Every single lawyer thinks that they have some immaculately special gotcha moment on everything. Mm -hmm. It's not how it works. Yeah. He was just saying, I don't think you had the reason to search her. And I said, we didn't search her. We frisk her. We frisk her. We find a gun. That's it. The end. Mm. So. All right, well... Yeah. Let me know if you have any other fucking lawyers. Don't feel, uh, don't be afraid to contact us too at the prosecutor's oh, office. Oh, we'll yeah. Come down. Yeah, no. I mean, this guy was, I can handle this guy. I'm usually pretty okay with him. So, but I will contact and I tell the cadets to contact them too whenever there are fucking cadets. I can't even believe that there's no one here today. That's concerning because we're. Uh... Yesterday there was um... a ton of people and. Ah. Uh... Yeah, I don't know what's happened between yesterday and today. Uh, but... What's going on with everyone's place being fucking fumigated? That's also, uh, you know, kind of concerning. So, like, everyone's place is being fumigated. Um, it's preventing, you know, if anybody has stuff that's in the fumigated place, you know. But, you know, it's very, very uh, serene when there's also not a lot of officers around, so. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, I'm going to get out of your hair. I've got mm -hmm. some paperwork to do. Yeah, so. but I'm going to do the paperwork as well, so. All right. I'll see you guys around. I'll come right. talk to you soon. All right. Bye. Bye. I help you with so you need to keep running in oh okay all right 
here's what I'm working on. It's hard to read. This has changed. Okay. That one's fine. Uh, 204, I'll be switching off motor. Uh, if we get into an 80, uh, well, I need someone to box. And there. No, not that kind of maze. Poppy, you okay? Nobody's here. Why, yeah, I know, I know, that's how it is. I'm, I'm gonna get on the uh, on my 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 dodge and head on out. Uh, okay. I don't want us to get stuck in an eighty and Not try and box with a motorcycle. Yeah. yeah. Be safe. And you give us a shout out for radio if you need us. We'll do. A two or four to, to ten eight. I can't even do this right now. <sighs> I'm gonna go patrol. I, I can't even okay. think about the paperwork. Okay, be safe. 
Well, I'm going to be in a 38 Innocence Boulevard, white color ruin I just crashed into a tree one time's occupied. Thank you for your service. Yep. Thank you. Thank you for protecting <laughs> us. They're running from mayor? You're leaving again! <laughs> oh wait, I'm going to a 38. Why am I stopping? 36 south on the trail, up to a 4 south traffic. We are all here. Yep. All the entire PD. We got the entire PD for this guy. Yeah. You see, you pulled her out of the driver's seat. So Washington and Poppy were both like thinking about it, but we were like, we can't. <laughs> we were like, we can't. <laughs> I was thinking about console. Who's the other unit that Davis? Not sure. Is that 33? Yeah, it's not in the middle of the road. You crashed off the side of the road. You're, on the, you're parked on the sidewalk. You're not parked. You're we might be sending a 69 year old to jail. Yep, yep, seemed like it. Yeah. Uh, this yeah. Disappointed in you. So disappointed. Why do you smell a pee? <laughs> no. Clean him up, Washington. Do your job. Yeah, clean up the streets of piss old men. Yep, and the man up there. The man up there is so disappointed in your pissing. Make your way over to the pawn, uh, pawn shop. Buy yourself some rollerblades so you can, can, can travel around without causing incident, without risking life or limb of either yourself or other individuals. Dude, we were supposed to do crime today. We were supposed to do crime today, and there's not enough fucking cops around. We are literally forced into working today.
Yeah, you'll die in rehabilitation. You'll never be rehabilitated. Yeah, you will not. It will be a life sentence for you just because you're nearly death pit. Do die! No, 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 no. What? No. But, but you will. He's old. Oh, I think I thought you said go die. No, I said he'll die. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. All right. My name is Joe Ross, no badge number 204. Everyone calls me Washington. If you see me again and you're committing a crime, I, I won't go easy. Now, now get. Go, go run to the, uh, the pawn store. Run! Master! You look very hip for an old man, I'll tell you that. Oh, thank you. I read a magazine on the flight in about the culture of rapping. I wanted to look young and hip. Run faster! Can you can you rap a bit for me? Do you want to hear something? All right, 204. Yeah. We're, we're cold for on this yeah, incident. Oh, dispatch. Uh, are you able to contact the tow lot? Yeah, go ahead. Give me some bars. 10 4. We'll contact them uh, and send it to your location. Yeah, uh, it's Crusade oh, Hospital right. just on the corner of Innocence and Davis Avenue. White and color ruiner. 10 4. I'm ready. Oh, My good to see you. We, we are low on numbers the there, but uh, oh, we're the doing our best. I don't need a dining, I don't need a night, I don't need anything to fuck your wife. I got <laughs> arthritis in my nose, stay trippy. But I won't hesitate to punch a damn hippie. I got a big chain, I saw it in a magazine. I'll steal your bitch just to make her my queen. I may be old, but I know how to party. Smoking on some reefer and sipping on a 40. Couple fine honeys, shaking their ass. Big Rob spit fire like he made a gas. And that's all I got. That's my first rap song I've ever written. I don't listen to a lot of rip rap, but that sounded magnificent. Do we have any officers available to uh, come uh, back to Davis and talk to two doctors uh, on urgent business? Oh, uh, 204. A, I'll make my day, way okay? over. Continued lovely day. Yeah, also uh, 204, 253 is uh, already here. Alright, 104, 253 is already there. I'll, uh, I'll stick with this vehicle for tow. Please don't let the urgent business. I wasn't speeding. Thank you for your service, sir. I wasn't even like what they going over the speed limit, but like if you're supposed to shut up. My shift has come to an end. No! Yeah. No! It has come to an end. No! Na, na, no! Na, 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 no! Na, 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 no! Na, 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 no! Na, 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 no! Na, na, na. No! Na, na, na! Na, na, na! No! Ah! Ah! Uh oh! Uh oh! Ah! Uh oh! Ah! Uh oh! Ah! 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 Ah!
I just want to go scuba diving. La, la, la. Go to the garage. <laughs> Let's go to the garage. Oh, this is weird. I can't really get my car back if I park it in here. Yeah. Oh. Na, 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 na. Oh, uh, yeah, I could just go to the front desk and sign up there. It's yeah. gonna be fine. I would stick around, but I get some important business. Mm hmm. So important. So important. That's not a purpose. We have no purpose here. We can't do anything for you here. So what? we have no purpose. Issue? You have what? no purpose. Hold on. What is the issue? There's no issue. He's they annoyed. they stopped to talk to me and now oh. they're like, you're loitering. They're you literally to talking talk to me. To us. Hold on. No, I said I don't have Nice car. car. So, like, don't Thank you. Weird, you know? I look real like cool. You don't gotta yep. like touch other people, man. That's All right. fucking weird. Like, Maybe just, see you in a bit. Hey, can you drop the hug? Maybe. Like, hey, NASCAR. Like, I don't want to we'll touch see. you, you know? If not, tomorrow is another day. A magnificent day. Each no, day is a blessing. I, I, I don't forget that, funny, gatekeeper. <sighs> that, that wasn't... That wasn't backseating. We're not gonna burn it down. It's fine. <laughs> Two oh four I thirty eight uh eastbound in this boulevard corner of Elgin just near the uh uh clothing store one time occupied hearse. See I was speaking as Lincoln. Speeding through red lights. Uh, I'm stepping out my vehicle. Two thirty seventy six to your location. Mr. Coleno, Colino, Colino, all right, you know why I pulled you over today? You know why is that? Yeah. And it was red when I saw it, either way, you were traveling at pretty high speeds. No, I saw it as red. I saw you go through the light as red. No, that's not the matter. I, the first thing I said to you is, I said, I saw you speeding through the red light. That is all there is to it. Uh, uh. No, not really. All right, all right. Yes, all right, all right, I understand. All right, okay. All right, is this your vehicle? Oh, 
233 to other units. Apparently there's going to be some sort of performance piece at uh, Strawberry Post Office. Somebody's going to fake their death. What? Yeah, I mean, he, it's... It's not supposed to be a big deal. It's supposed to be like he's a musician and he wants to have a come back from the dead concert later on. Is this why there is a mark here or a curse here? Uh, oh, I, I don't know. I'm not there. Oh, I'm, I'm heading down. Okay, what is the individual's name? Do you know? Sanitary for you to be leaving uh, your pizzas and your do, do you know the individual's name? Paul Roach. Okay, I'm gonna step out of the vehicle for a sec. I gotta pick them up, take them to the morgue. Bing, bang, boom, ding, da, bing, da, boop, beep, boo, woo. Hey, how you doing? Good looking. Hi. Why don't you, why do you, why do you sound so miserable today? What happened? Please don't hit on my colleagues. I'm not hitting on her. I'm asking her why she sounds like she's in a bad mood, Joe. Guess what? What um, happened today? Uh, give me get a on, moment. Get to... on the radio with, with the other officer. Oh, yeah, sure thing. <sighs> what why? is your name? Mac Kalina, why? Sorry, send it again. It's Mac Kalina, why? Mac Kalina, why? Uh -huh. Like, Mac Kalina and then the why at the end? No, why? What, why? Because I don't yeah, know why? your name. My name is Officer Poppy. I am okay. suffering from allergies. That's I'm maybe sorry. why I sound a little bit, you know. Yeah, <sighs> So anyways, uh, you are, uh, you are doing something with this horse. Is this correct? Yeah, I was dropping off a pizza in Vespucci. Why the French toast are you dropping off this the, No, what? Well, because the guy with the moped, Chasha, isn't, on, uh, isn't at work yet, so. So you use a horse? Yeah, we use the horse in the front. And, uh, if, you know, if he's around, he'll use a little moped, but sure. I, had to, I had to deliver two pies. What? Okay. Right. Give me that's, a second, That's the direction I was coming in. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. All right, sir. So, look, uh, this will be your one warning from me. Uh, okay. You will be free to go at this time, but if I catch you speeding or running red lights again... Uh, in one of these hosts, I will be charging you for it, all right? Yes, sir, I understand. And hey, you know what? You've changed. I'm impressed. What? It's so nice. I've always been it's nice. Like you, it's like both of you switched. Now now Joey, Joey Bags is fucking nice. And then um, Pink Head Lady, you know, is just not... She, you're nice, but you're like sad. You know what I'm saying? Why are you sad? Uh, all right, you're I'm free to go. Leaving. I got other matters Wait, to deal with. I what the it's not it's not your fault. I just oh, I got no, other things no, to deal with. No, we're just really right? busy today. Okay, bye, -bye. Uh, Thank you. I apologize right. there, Mac. No, you have a great good. day now, all right? You too, sir. Sorry. Oh, no, it's not, no, your, it's not fault. your fault. No, you're free to hey. go. You're free to go. Okay, I'm going to make a right on red. Thank you. The, uh, what's it called? The... Post office. Ten nine nine. That wasn't my car yet. Oh, uh, seven six. The post office. Confirm. When is this happening? Ah, uh, good question. Styles, Styles, don't sit there. What? What? Hey y'all, can one of y'all help me press some charges? Well, on what? Uh, on the on a doctor. For what? Like 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 actually like it's not really funny. Oh. Uh, forget for for uh, having the Carson Crooks attack me. 
Oh, Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. Go, go down to the, go down to the station. Okay. Okay, right. when is this other thing happening? It's supposed to be happening like right fucking now. Oh, fuck me. All right, I'll, I'll stay if you want to go talk to him. Uh, yeah, get to Washington's car, I'll go talk to him. I'm having a robot headache, that's all. Okay. Yeah. Not a great time for a migraine. You're doing great work, ma'am. Thank you. Screw this one, though. Would you like me to top off your vehicle? Uh, no, it's pretty topped off, but thank you. Okay. You stay safe, ma'am. Okay, what's going on? Uh, well, first of all, Dr. Drake and his friends are trying to kill me. That's been going on for about a week now. Okay, do you have any weapon? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to pat you down. Please turn around. Can I go put it away? Sure. Okay. What? <sighs> Sir! Sorry, I couldn't figure out how to make the roller skate stop. Oh my god, do you require your mess? Yo, I'm alright, it just it was going okay. way too fast. Oh wait, um, let me pat you down. Sorry. This way. 2.30 is going to be 10.7 taking a report. Davis. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's, I'm, sorry. A I, I'm a little shooken up. Uh, a little, to be oh, 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 very, very scared for my life. Okay. Okay. Because. Uh. Okay, you can come in here. Uh, if it is okay with you, I am going to record this. Is that fine? Yeah, that's okay. 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 You may take a seat there. There's nobody else in the station at this time. Uh, I am Officer Poppy. I'm Poppy. Uh, mm -hmm. I could just have you state your uh, na full name. Uh, Peter Yin. Uh, P E T E R Y I N. Okay. And you say this started about the, a week ago? Yeah. So, well, a week and a half ago, uh, I met a guy named Dr. Drake. He was like a real dick to me. Uh, I met him with my fiance. He, my fiance told him not to be a dick to me. Uh, so every time we hung out, like three times after that, he was fine. He was real nice. Um, and then the first time I saw him without my fiance, uh, he was just a raging dick again. It was awful. And then, so like things escalated. Uh, someone got shot. Uh, I got arrested for it. Uh, the officer who arrested me, Officer O'Neill. He, I don't know where he's been. I really need him. Um, but he's the only one that, like, saw how these doctors were actually treating me. Uh, because, like, he, the whole time I was being arrested, he was like, why are these doctors fucking coming down to the south side and harassing you? And I, I don't know. I couldn't tell. Um, so then I ran in. Dr. Drake comes down the next day after that, after someone gets shot, uh, like, after a whole situation. And he starts doing this, hey, buddy, hey, Pete, how are you? Like, and then, like, be a real condescending. And then um, I'm like, get away from me. And then he starts talking shit. And I'm like, get the fuck away from me. And then he wouldn't. Uh, and I was like, get away from me or I'm or going to stab you. I swear to God, I'll pull out a knife and I'll stab you. Get away from me. And then 
uh, a officer walks up with white hair and she starts saying uh he's like he just threatened me and then the other girl rosaline she's like he threatened him he threatened him i was like oh. and then the hold on one second uh, i'm going to pause you for one second the officer okay. with white hair male she, or female yeah. female oh what did she say uh that dr drake is a great man and he she knows him personally and, and that uh she doesn't believe anything i'm saying oh, okay oh okay. uh, uh, because i tried to explain myself and no one no one cares no one I've, I've tried to report this to multiple police no one cares the only cop that i trust is danny and he's fucking off leave by absence <laughs> uh yeah I haven't been able to report nothing, but the the Rosalie chick, uh, I tried to walk away because there was because of the cop. I tried to walk away. Uh, I didn't want to like escalate anything. And the Rosalie chick just like follows me and starts saying all sorts of crazy stuff. She's a doctor. And she's saying like she hopes that I'm would, like she's off duty when I get hurt, and that like she she hopes she's not there to save me. And shit like that. Oh. And I was like, you're a fucking doctor. She's like, I can say whatever I want off duty. I said, so so can I. So next time I see you, I'm gonna fucking kill you. If you can say shit like that, like I I said that. Okay, too, right? so Rosalie say that next time she. So yeah. say what she well, said again. It's not. Is I don't know if that's word for word. Well, I'm saying what generally what she said. Yeah. Was uh, next time you get her, I hope I'm not on duty. That's essentially, she said, next time you, I, you get hurt, I won't be there. Like, I hope I'm not there to save you. Crazy, crazy shit. I said, why? Doctors shouldn't say shit like that. And she said, I'm off duty. I can say whatever I want. Uh, so that's what I said. Well, the next time I'll go kill you. So then, uh, the next time I saw her, she was at Southside Post Office again, talking to three Carson Crooks, uh, like gang members. Uh, I walk in. I didn't say anything to her. I walk out. Didn't say anything to her. She points at me and says, and it "Is so." I said, "Why are you pointing at me?" Because you're the guy who threatened my life. And then the Carson Crooks lady pulled out a gun, and I pulled out a gun, and we had like a little standoff. And then uh, the the other Carson Crook shot me down. Uh, I I shot Rosalie. This the only person uh, I hit. But that, is, but they all shot. They all shot me down. Three Carson Crooks members. Okay, and the Carson Crooks members, do they wear? I'm not super familiar. I, they wear red. Okay. Yeah. And which individual first pulled out the gun? It was a Carson Crook member. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. The, and it uh, was the, after Rosalie the, pointed you out and said, "There he is." Yep. Okay. Yeah. The and then the crazy thing is, this is what like I was trying to talk to Ru like I wanted to talk to Ruby and Doctor Lipshit about it, um, and they like were trying to make me feel safe and everything, mm -hmm. and then they said that I'm banned from the hospital for this situation. Uh, that you are banned from the hospital for this situation. Okay. Yeah, and this happened at Southside Post Office. So I banned from I banned from the hospital unless I need medical assistance. I have to immediately leave once I'm done. Um. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. And they like. No one believes me because they're doctors. Okay. Uh. When you shot back. Uh. Well, the police come to this situation. Is there a report when you shot uh, Rosalie? No, no, I don't know what happened. I got shot by so many bullets. I don't even remember okay. what happened. Okay, okay. I was, I don't know where I went. I don't know. I don't know what happened. How long ago was this? La uh, the night before last. Okay, let's maybe let me see something. She's, she is like so fucking mean to me. And no, and no one cares because okay. they they just say they just say that they're doctors, you know. And then everybody gets real angry. Uh, how do you spell your last name? 
Y I N. Your first name. Peter P E T E R. Yeah, it doesn't seem like anybody seems to be taking it seriously at all. And I'm just kind of the the guy that is going to have to just suck it up and deal with abuse from medical staff. So. Okay, I'm, I'm reading this. Give me a second. Did you you shot somebody? Who? Uh, at the hospital the other day. No, I did not shoot anybody at the fucking hospital. What the fuck? Did you? It was at the Southside Post Office. No, no, no. This is a few days ago. Yes. No, no, no. I never shot any. I would never shoot anybody at the hospital. What the fuck? Do you see? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me. Oh my God, dude. Hold on, hold on. Why is this happening to me? Did you shoot Mr. Bernstein? Who is that? What do you mean, who is that? Mr. Bur- Oh, what's his first name? Uh, Perry. I was at the fucking Southside PO. No, no, no. I'm talking about the different incident. I'm just looking at and creating a narrative here. I have never shot. I've never been anything but respectful at the hospital, and I would never be anything but that. That's craziness. Isn't there cameras? It's a fucking hospital. Shot someone at a hospital. Fuck me, dude. I mean, this is definitely you. What? And it says I shot someone at the hospital. It's a fucking lie. And that is a bull. That is absolutely fraudulent. There is security. There has oh, I'm to sorry, be. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. No, you're all right. Uh. And this is this is at the post office. I, I this this report is formatted very poorly. I fucking hate how these reports are formatted. So you did you did pull shoot somebody in the south side then, yeah? What what? You did shoot somebody in the south side the other day at the post office. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Perry, I got arrested for that shit. Yeah, yeah, I told, yeah. I told okay, you that okay. And... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm just going over because this is the only, this is the latest report that I have. Uh, I don't I know have I've anything. Already been... 
I've already served my time for it, and yep, you don't yep. really have, you don't feel one way or another about it. I didn't mean but to, I sorry. Learned, yeah, I, uh, uh, I, I, uh, I, I, why that, I blacked out. Okay. A guy came up during this, an hour, an hour of arguing with Dr. Drake and, and this shit, and them doing this shit to me. Uh, I was I was arguing with Dr. Drake and, and he was arguing with Mikey O'Neill and then this guy just comes up out of nowhere and says, You're not gonna do anything. You're not a top guy. You you just a scumbag. Swear to a random guy, the Perry guy, came up and said that to my face. Uh, like okay. I, and, and and then I blacked out. Yeah. And then I shot and then I ran and then I tried to put my hands up, but they shot me down, understandably. I, I get it. I right, right. I'm, I'm just looking. I'm just looking for this. If there's any response? Ah, uh, to the one at uh. Okay, maybe it's this one. So, so here's like my question is like, what, what would you do if like you were in my shoes? Like if, if, a doc um, if what I'm saying mm -hmm. is a hundred percent true and a doctor was sicking gang members on you, uh, what, what would you do? Well, uh, I'm trying to see if there is a potential For a restraining order. But I will have to bring this to a higher up. Ugh. I really, I, really I, wish. I just, uh, I feel like real helpless and, I, and I've never felt this way. Yeah, I understand the position that you are in. Uh, and I want to help you. I'm just trying to see if there is any report. Uh, you say this is two days ago. This happened at the Southside Post Office, yeah? The with the with the Perry thing, if I have no, like no, not the Perry ago. thing. Uh, uh, the uh, the one where yeah. you shoot the doc, uh, the the well, yeah. I, I was just shooting, they were shooting <laughs> at me. Yeah, no, I understand. Uh, with uh, the was it the what time was it around? Um. It's like uh, during this oh, storm. Uh, way earlier. Way, before. way earlier? Like... Yeah, like six hours ago, probably. Something like that. Okay. See, I think it's this one. And I have, uh, well, one one witness to it. Mm -hmm. I have one. I have one witness to it is Jesse Love, and then because no one was there because it was so fucking early in the morning, and then Mikey O'Neill is witness to how these doctors are treating me and harassing me. Okay, I'm going to call in another officer, um, just to determine what the best course of action for you is here, okay? Yeah, okay. Uh, because I, 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 I believe you. Um, you do? Yeah. No one else believes me. No, I believe you. Why would you? Okay, listen, you're somebody that has, you're a convicted violent felon, right? Yeah. Let me, let me just, you're a convicted violent villain who has admittedly shot people. You are convicted of attempted or second degree murder, right? Yeah. Why? Just, why would you come here? Otherwise, if you're not in fear for your life from doctors. I'm, I'm so scared. Yeah, no, I, un I understand. Why would you come here otherwise? I don't know. 
It, it's, it's, look, I don't have anything on me that I can give you. It's so, okay. Yeah. I'll wipe up all these papers. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay. 2.30 and 2.204. Get out of the post office! Two oh four from two thirty. Oh shit, Poppy, are you alright? Oh, I'm a bad headache. Oh. All right. You need uh, need some aspirin or anything? No. Okay, uh, a couple things to be clarifying. Who is your yeah. fiance? Uh, Jesse Love. You're just a uh, milkshake. Yay. <laughs> yeah, just Jesse Love. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this is. That's interesting. I can't see the radio. Nothing right there. Okay. Uh, Jesse Love. I could just get her to come in. I, I don't. She might. Uh, uh, she might even be awake. I haven't been able to check my mail. Okay, I'm. I'm trying to get in contact with another one of my officers. Uh, that will have. Um, because I'll tell you, like right now, we don't have enough uh, to do anything, uh, unfortunately. Uh, but um, I, I know. Mm -hmm. but, so, but what we yeah. can do is potentially uh, put in place a potential like restraining order. Uh, okay. I just don't know exactly how to do that. Uh, two of four, I'll be seventy six to the latest forty seven. Uh, actually, two of four. Could you uh, twenty five back to Davis? I have a question for you. Ten for twenty two, my last. I'll be seventy six to Davis. Thank you. Oh, yeah, they have a lot of EMS. In the jungle sometimes, I wonder why I keep going under. Where is Mikey O'Neill? I don't know. Okay, why do you what need to talk to Mikey O'Neill? Uh, he... Because he knows. Okay. He knows what these doctors are doing to me. He know he saw through it. He's the only guy that saw through it, okay. man. Him and Dr. Lipschitz. I swear they're the only people who see through their bullshit. They're bad people. They're bad dogs. They shouldn't be. They're not trying to help people. And if they were, why would they harass someone like me? Why would, why would you go down to the south side looking to harass someone like me? Oh 
makes no sense. Let me see if my other officers here are right back. Where's Papa? Oh, uh, here. You said she was your aide. I, I am. Over here, Washington. Where's uh, over here? Over here. Oh, there you are. There. What's the matter, Papa? I, I got a weird. Got. A weird situation. Um, this guy's being threatened by doctors that they're and the doctors are sending gang members after him to kill him. Sorry, say, say again. This guy is being threatened by doctors, and the doctors are sending gang members after him to kill him. Oh, who is the guy? Uh, admittedly a violent felon, but he is. Fucking terrified, doesn't know what else to do, and I don't know why he would come to PD. Okay, if you say Maurice Washington... It is not I'm fucking not... Maurice Washington. Okay, who who is it then? It is... Second... Peter Yin. There was a situation the other day, but I cannot find a report on it. What's um, the guy's name again? Peter Yin, Y-I-N. Uh, so there was a situation the other day, uh, his gripe is with Dr. Drake and Rosalie, uh, Rosalie apparently was talking to the second, the Carson Crooks, these are the people in red, um, pointed him out when he was in the strawberry post office. One of the Carson Crooks pulled out a gun. He pulled out the gun. Shooting ensued. He got riddled with bullets. This was uh, at the time that was about six hours before now. So potentially there was not any response from PD. And he just got shot so many times and was in the hospital. I just said. Uh said Dr. Drake was one of the individuals. Uh, initially, yes, and Dr. Rosalie is on Dr. Drake's side. Um, and Dr. Rosalie has said that next time you get hurt, I hope I'm not on duty. Um, Peter is saying doctors shouldn't say shits like that. And she says that she's off duty, she can say whatever she likes. And then she said, well, he said, well, I'm not the doctor, I'm off duty, so, like, I'm going to kill you. EMS to PD? I'll send it for PD. Uh, we got a call about um, an unconscious person up at the Humane Labs. Uh, we are a little suspicious about the call. Follow me. Uh, we do not want to send EMT in just yet. Uh, do you have... Yeah, I'll, I'll be 76. I, I have him in interrogation right now, so I can't... Oh, you have him in interrogation? Yes. yes. What, Yin? Yes. Okay, I'll get a full statement from Yin and then charge mm. him with whatever it is. Uh, He's not then being I charged. Need to... Okay, then he uh, came in because he's he fucking be terrified released. for his yes. life. And then I would speak to Drake afterwards. Mm -hmm. uh, have you seen uh, Mr. Yin's first uh, ever charge? Let me go check it. It was the first thing I did. Individuals reported. It seems like him and Dr. Drake have a history of some incidents. Uh, he was charged with second uh, attempted second degree murder for uh, uh, shooting. Shooting uh, Mr. Drake after an argument that they had. So there's clearly some history of robbery between the two of them. Uh, yes, there is. Uh, uh -huh. So I would get Yin's statement and then immediately go get Drake and uh, ask him for his statement as well. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go and uh, 
one i recommend that you stay as far away from uh dr drake and rosalie as humanly possible yeah, I'm not allowed to go to the hospital. Right. Uh, sorry, we're getting a bunch of... Ah, oh, fuck. I, I have to go. Um, I'm going okay. to uh, get a statement from Dr. Drake as well. Um, and I will open a, a report on this, okay? But it's given... Hey, he's just gonna lie. He's I, I, such a liar. Believe me, I, I understand this. Uh, but I have to he's do so my... so damn charmed. So am I. Very true. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Yep. Uh, I'll give you my postal code. Uh, in case you need anything, if you can write it down. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. Let me know when you're ready. Okay. It is. Oh, not that one. Yep. No. Okay. Okay, it is indigo, indigo, two eyes, nine seven five. Okay, cool. Poppy. Yep, Poppy. Yep, okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Yep, no problem. All right. See. You. Uh, two o four. Do you want the seventy seven to human? Two four. Ready attack. Ten two. Uh, two thirty to two o four. Poppy? Yeah? Hey, uh, are you able to uh, help me with that thing? I don't know if it got done. I haven't checked my mailbox uh, from yesterday. I'm, I'm, I might not be able to at the moment. All good. Sorry, I'm good. The, we're, we're really short right now. All right, all yeah, right. I'll be I'm back so, later. Okay. Washington! Okay, I'm going to 76 to Humane. God damn it. Six gun tonight. Thank you for your service, yep. officer. Oh my fucking god, he's probably on channel two. Uh two thirty, transitioning to channel two to check for Washington. Two thirty to two oh four. Two oh four might have stepped out of uh, his vehicle. Okay, so he is a oh, god damn it. I didn't hear that he transitioned. Is everything clear at human? Uh, I believe there's. Sorry, 10 9. Is everything clear at human? Do you know? Uh, this is 
dispatch. As far as I know, they are all out of their vehicles searching at the moment. Hey, Farron, I'm going to 76 because I was screaming for Washington. I didn't realize he was on channel 2. I'm going to switch back to channel 1. If he comes back on channel 2, uh, can you switch to channel 1 and just let me know, please? What can do? Thank you. Two thirty back on channel one. Uh, all units that are at Humane Labs are currently out of their vehicles searching. I'm still going to seventy six location. Make sure everything is code four. Ten four. Ten four. I'm right behind you. What? <sighs> That's the best way over there. Go for PD. Uh, two thirty is back on the on the radio. Inform. I still don't know the status of whatever's going on up here. Neither. <laughs> huh. I'll see if I can grab it. Yeah, hold on, let me talk to Emus. Did you find a down person? Uh, we cannot no, find them. They're inside, I think. They're inside? I think they're inside, but the yeah. uh, doors are locked. Oh, shit, okay. Uh, it's Washington. The EMS said there's water entrance. Do you know water entrance? Oh no. Each side, he say. I have scuba gear. Oh. I don't think I have. I don't know. Beachy is behind us. I don't know. Okay, where's is. Washington? Can you tell Washington uh, that I'm on scene, please? Okay. It's a puppy sun, eh? Yeah. Echo 166 to Washington. Wow, all of you guys showed up. Uh, well, uh, that happens when put... somebody doesn't respond on radio. Oh, sorry. I, I, I said I was going to over over the EMS frequency. Um, I don't think anybody heard you. Oh, uh, well, that's on them for not listening to the damn radio then. There's a scuba tank right here. I also have a scuba tank. Okay, um... um... Each side, how we got to be where that tunnel is. I'm gonna be honest, I don't have So here, you go on the other I'm side. sure I they could find it. it. All right, yeah, yeah. Oh, all right. Wait, 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 can, we go, can we go scuba diving now? You know where the, uh, pop the, it. Pipes the intention are. is that we're gonna go. Do you mind passing it over? Uh, <laughs> oh, I thought she gave but you didn't one. go yesterday. No. Yeah, are pop it. Uh, the, the intention is that we might not come back. Oh, okay. All right, I'm gonna make my way over to the beach. Wait, wait, wait! Four minutes. Yeah, four wait, minutes. I want to come! Please! You're gonna need an EMS there. Oh, uh, Papa, I'm gonna need one EMS with me. I don't yeah, want. Alright, uh, Brett, jump in. If you got a yeah. scuba tank. Oh, no, Papa, pop the I whole point is to. Papa, <laughs> we might not make it back. <laughs> well, I don't want you to not make it back, and then I don't make it back. Okay, I need fair. one officer and one <laughs> EMS to go to try and save the individuals down there. Poppy, did you say you have a scuba suit? Uh -huh. I'm gonna laugh if they all Can I please borrow yours? Yeah, yeah. Poppy, please hand it over to the EMS. Uh, we go can down, go scuba dive in sa safely. Yesterday. Yeah, we can go in a safe environment <laughs> another time, but uh, this is not a safe environment. <sighs> all right, I'm we'll sorry, Poppy. Alright, jump in, Brett. <laughs> 
So it goes. Yeah, I'll try and stay. Oh, wait, didn't I not hear that to you? No. Nope. I didn't think it was too heavy. Oh, it's not. Thank you very much. No, I've, got, I've, got, uh, a I've got a I've got a flashlight. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Poppy. Mm. Good luck, Brother Thank you. All right, let's oh. let's make our way over. Okay, two o four and one EMS are going to try to go into Humane Labs to get the downed individual. later another person so what happened there's some people down there stuck and yeah, they get stuck oh jesus yeah so definitely inside though because it looked like inside a building so they go under through the water you look on the roof uh, we didn't have a chance to, but they have a ladder mm -hmm. over there. I want to. I'm going you to know. look on the roof. Ah, net. Okay, I'll show you ladder. stepping out the vehicle. Hey, I thought I heard something. Hey, watch out! Watch out! I heard something near the boxes. Something not good. Wait, is oh, that a bird? Uh, Wait! Oh god! Oh, it's... <laughs> it's it's Jennifer! Oh god! You had the same idea to check the upstairs. Yeah. yeah. Why, we Jennifer, you scare me so bad. Why? I heard the movement, but I didn't see you because you blend oh. with the shadows. So I say, Wait, what the hell? I tried. Is there a car here? No, there was no car. In, uh, go get some extra scuba tanks just in case. Oh, yeah. Do you need any money? I'll, I'll that later. No, we got. I have well, $20. I can 50. give you 50 I got oh, so 50 Richard. bucks on me. I'm good, but. I don't know. Do you got any money on you, uh. No. Danny? Alright, we need I another got 50 bucks. Yeah, and they took my scuba tank, so... Yeah. Uh, Washington Watch and I were supposed mine. to go scuba in yesterday. I am disappointed. I can give you 20. Oh, well, don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm sure there'll be other points. <sighs> uh, don't leave me behind. Not leaving you behind, don't worry. <gasps> I want to just look around. I've never been up here. Ah. Oh. Please don't be in! 
What's my answer? Fuck. I could sound like this too. Oh no. Why is he going back? Dude, I would cook meth here. Hey, puppy son, did you jump off the roof earlier? Yeah, I did. Like very high up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I, I saw you, but you look like shadowy figure. Oh god. Oh, it's so I'm, scary. I'm, I, I almost I'm, shit my pants. <laughs> I'm a little concerned because, uh, I feel like Washington keep going in and out. Huh? I feel like Washington's keep going in and out. How much air did you get with the scuba tanks? Um, uh, I know you have to keep going up and down, even though I've never ever been scuba diving before, but you know, I kind of read about it, and I'm a very good swimmer. Ooh, mm. like 10 minutes, ne? No, no, I think oh, no, 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 way less than 10 minutes. Oh! <gasps> Really? Yeah, you have to keep going. Like the the yeah, oxygen tank is leaky, so you like oh. under five, you have to keep coming back up for air. Uh oh. Yeah, that's hey, demo. Good. I think uh, Breto san she should know because she is uh, diving certified. So I hope she tell him. It takes at well, least were... five minutes to go from one end of that tunnel to the other. Oh. Uh. Well, he is, he is, he's getting to be back. Uh, toward the middle of the tunnel now. Ah, so to say, you guys have sensor, don't you? Uh huh. Mm. Oh, good, good, good. So you can see if he move. Uh huh. But then the I, EMS I don't... don't have anything. Yeah, no. Uh, I see there's a worker at the front, though. I saw, I saw that guy. He very scary looking. Mm -hmm. Hands on his hips, guy, ne? Who is he? Don't know. <laughs> yeah, like that, just yeah. like that. Though. I asked him to. <laughs> I asked him to open the door. Oh. You he said no. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. Uh, it's in the good. it's in the middle. 
Yeah, James I Bond know. Uh, I want my scuba gear. What's going on? I don't know. There's another unconscious person. I don't yeah, have my scuba gear. Yeah, I, I got a couple. Come on. Okay, hey, come with me. So, uh, you guys can go dive uh, there. I'll try to Are go you from sure? the other side. I, I, I don't. I need scuba. You dive. I need scuba he gear. Has, he has two. He has two. I okay. got you. I got you, Poppy. Okay. Are you ready? Do you know where you're going? Yes, I do. Okay. Do you know where you're going? I need to follow you. I have a general idea and I know how to dive. Oh god. I'm s I'm gonna end up saving everybody, aren't I? I don't think so. Fuck, oh. where is that? Not here, it's down okay. south. Okay. Oh <laughs> Alright, hop in, we're going mm -hmm. around the other Looks uh, like wait, ammo. Hold on. Is this your car? I'm putting my other stuff in your car. Yeah, no worries. Okay. Someone just target practice. Uh, all this other stuff I can lose. Is that it? That... That's a PDM. What the <laughs> fuck? Somebody's shooting over a PDM. No, that's not a PDM. That's an oh. ammunition. Oh, okay. Do you have a word, it's going to be uh, 23 at the shots fired. Washington be really the wanted to go in here, huh? Oh, yes, you did. <laughs> you did, too. Radio. Wait, can we even get over there through here? No, you have to go down to the beach. And our, and our uh, keys don't work. You tried that, yeah? Uh, did no, are they locked on you? Yet? Let me just, let me just see. Let me just see if my key works. Let's see if your key works. No, my key does not work. That is weird. That would have been easy to go through. To... That would be nice, wouldn't it? Yep. Oh, wait, they're leaving. Who's leaving? Uh, Washington is leaving. But there's still that downed person. I thought Washington was diving. How is he, he leaving? Is. Well, I mean, if he's going back oh. through. Oh, where are we going? Well, I don't know. I just was marking where the downed person was. You okay, can go so... around here. Yeah. Up to the right. Uh, yeah. Well, you can turn around here and, and try to hug it around. Go off road. The... Yeah. It's not the best vehicle, but ah. Uh... Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Is this where we want to go? Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Go around. I know the backwards ambulance kind of thing is working the best, honestly. Oh, figure. Uh, any units at the labs on radio yet? Sorry. Uh, yes, we are still code 6 in the area for the downed individual. Okay, 10 4. I just wanted to make sure I, I wasn't I have a you feeling guys. somebody else drowned under there. It shouldn't take four minutes to swim all of that, unless you're not swimming through your eyes. I've I'm gonna park that. right here because I yeah, don't, yeah. well, don't want to get yeah. stuck on the beach. Um, before we go, can you give me like a quick top up? Sorry, I kind of fell. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No and their car is here. There's no one down there. There was another call. I saw the that, car. yeah. We, we panicked, thought you might think it was us. I, I went down there, there's a long tunnel. We swam all the way through, took mm -hmm. us a long time. We come out into a little 
air bubble, I guess. Go through a door. There's an elevator at the end, but it's broken. There's no one Might in there. I need a key card, yeah. A key card? N no, I no, had a no, look at... Like, yeah, I had a look you know. at the, the panel. You know, I had a look. I tried easing my way into it, everything, and nothing mm -hmm. happened. I couldn't see nothing. I couldn't even see a hole. It's just the two locked garage doors up there that we can't see. Yeah, I, I think if someone's made their way oh, inside, no. either they've found another way in or they've broke, broken in. Oh, in a you way couldn't they get have. in through the elevator area? No, the elevator it was wasn't non-functional. Yeah. Oh, you guys want to try to like shove me through the door or anything like that? Oh, just to... I think if they force their way in like uh -huh. that, then, then it's, uh, th th that's th their problem. Well, problem. If, yep. if we do that, then let's get some numbers. Uh, no, mm -mm. I'm sure someone will deal with that if it's that kind of yeah. situation. That's yeah. not for us to deal with. Oh, so you guys already went down there and everything, though? Yeah, we swam all yeah, the way down, it, all yeah. the way to the bottom, got to the elevator. I uh, had a look at the panel, uh, tried to ease my way in. I wonder if they're, like, stuck up oh, by you can the keep uh, it. panels. I oh, don't well, know. Maybe. Where would they we'll, be? We'll have another look. You, but, uh, yeah, we'll go look around, I guess. I have if another you guys one, already so swam down it. there, there's no, no reason for us okay. to go down there. I, I am too heavy. Uh, oh, all right. Keep it. Throw it in your trunk. Yeah, I'll just throw in my trunk. Sorry, what are you guys doing? Ah, right, jump in and I'll give you a lift back. Uh, no need to walk. Oh, can one of you can carry. Oh, I Where's can fit Jenny? four. Jenny! Oh, Jenny! Jenny! There's a, there is an ambulance right there. Yeah, that's oh. my ambulance. Oh. Ah, right, just jump in. I'm gonna be lazy. <laughs> We did just swim all that way. Uh, 204 to EMS. Uh, we, we searched all under humane labs and the tunnels and everything. It's inaccessible. The elevator does not work. There's no one down there. Uh, we'll continue to check the rooftops, but uh, I think these bozos might be dead. Oh, God. Oh, uh, if those are the EMS at uh, 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 Humane Labs, they, they, they might be out their vehicle still. 269 is currently getting in our ambulance. I'll have to check. Ah. It's just the the oh, we, we just have the individuals the here at the car back to a lot. Wait. Just the uh, one. Uh, Sergeant Marino to Where Bobby. Go for Where Bobby. Find him? Uh, did the. Uh, I, I just talked to uh, Peter Yin, said he had a chat with you. I have a report up from uh, Dr. Lipschitz yeah, where was he? Uh, that has some information regarding him, if you'd like to talk about in a bush. Okay. Wait, is this no, the no, guy you were talking about most? I am currently up at uh, Humane. I need to, I wanted to talk oh, to a superior uh, about his situation, so uh, if you are if you're on leave, he, he trusts you the most, but... You were scuba diving? Yeah. Next thing I know, I'm here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, well. I will uh, begin to 76 back. Right. Give me There's a second. There's a lot of bruising all over. Not good. Um, can you Where's move your legs? Where's the car with my stuff in it? Aww. Oh, it's back at the original. It's not my car. Oh, shoot. Can you wiggle your fingers and toes for me, sir? Can you bring me back around? Uh, are you able to bend your arms and legs? And put your knees and your elbows? Can you bring me back around the other side? Don't fall. There, we found the downed individual up at the main. It took us forever. You guys, uh... Shots fired. Is this your car, Poppy? Um, let me see. It's got my stuff in it. This one? Yeah. Nope. Whose car is this? Don't know. This one, mine. Oh. Do you have keys to this car? Uh, I don't, I'm afraid. 
This has my stuff in it too. Oh damn it. This is not your car, Poppy. No, this is my car. Um. Now I question whether we should arrest that individual for trespassing. I think he's spent enough time. Sorry, I could lock. Do I have a lockpick? I don't even have a lockpick. Uh, PD, who are on scene at Humane Labs? Who left their vehicle here? Uh, 233 or 250. Yeah, 233. Did you, uh... Were you taking that's someone else's of, car? That's a lot of car shots. Uh, there, there negative, the negative. 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 This is mine. I, um... I have, I have keys. Uh, Pop, are you sure you don't have keys to this? This is... This is my... Wait. Step out. This is my car. Oh, this is my car. God damn it, Pop. I'm sorry! Papa's. It's my car. Uh, oh, it wasn't working before. My baton. Wait, do I have the? Oh, this is somebody else. Okay, this is my stuff. All right. There you go. All right, I've recovered my stuff. Visual, the, the 47 with a uh, trespassing. Uh, all right, I'm going to bring him in for question and uh, find out what he says. I might arrest him. I'll be 76 to the pillbox medical. I'm gonna switch over to channel two. Uh, I've also called the, they're, they're clear of the 71s. Somebody just drove away, started firing bullets, but nobody from EMS is hurt or have been shot at. Turn from. Two thirty going to be seventy six to Davis. <laughs> uh, ten, ten four. Uh, thank you to the officers who came to check up on me up at uh, Humane. Seventy six to two three three is twenty. Hello. Uh two three three twenty three, the latest shots fired and down the individual. We we got one down on the ground. So we definitely need EMS. EMS one twenty on station, moving in.
230 made through 1050 but a white sports car he just t-boned me out of nowhere it was a local jesus christ really did not feel like a local. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Two thirty twenty three Davis. Happy. Yeah, what? Happy. You alright? You need ice cream. No. Okay, what were it, you uh, saying over the radio? So if you want to look at report uh 1498, uh Dr. Lipschitz came in here and gave me like a whole statement about uh how she feared for the lives of three different parties at the hospital. And uh I don't know, I saw I just saw Peter at the post office and he was telling me just got trespassed from the hospital or some shit. Q4, 76 to build So I don't know if that, that helps at all. He said he had talked to you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I was, I was looking into it. Uh, it didn't get too far at the hospital. The uh, yeah, none of the stories up. were really matching up. Uh, hold on, hold on. Four, two fifty needs to get repairs real quick. Uh, two thirty will be off radio. Uh, working on report. Uh, sorry, I've been having a bit of a headache today. Um, and let's go in the back real quick. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so what did what did we say? about the stories matching uh, i went down there and tried to talk to uh dr rose about mm -hmm. the deal um she, oh, shit, she really didn't to stop recording god damn it oh god oh That'd the tapes lot, used oh. fuck ah uh, shit oh it's okay i'll just so I went. I talked to Dr. Rose. Basically, she told me that uh, this PETA guy had been kind of uh, a very hostile patient. Yeah. Ran into. They ran into each other at a post office, and uh, she shot. Or she got shot by him, and then 
her girlfriend, I guess, shot him back. Uh, I guess he wasn't arrested for that, and then... Yeah, it's just been like an ongoing thing since... So, I every... talked to him today, right? And... Yeah. Uh, hold on, I have my notebook. I haven't put it into a report, but honestly, I'm probably going to add it to your report and change the title to... Uh... Actually, probably yeah. the title will just stay the same. Um, So... In that incident, because... I don't think any PD responded to it. I couldn't find a report for it. Um, I think Rose is, if she has a girlfriend, that girlfriend is in the Carson Crooks. Oh, really? Okay. Yes. Uh, and so what he said, he said he went into there, the post office, didn't say anything to Dr. Rosalie. Uh, Rosalie basically pointed him out and said that's him where the female with the Carson Crooks uh, pulled out a gun pointed it at him uh, he pointed a gun at her like back and then the rest of the crooks I think pointed their guns this is my understanding of the situation right um, that sounds about right he, he shot about one time hit Rosalie and then he was absolutely turned into Swiss cheese mm. Which, yeah, of course, like you're facing that many people, but yeah, why the fuck would he shoot? Dumbass. Well, I mean, he had the gun pointed at him. He pointed the gun back. He, I think, just wanted to leave the situation, right? Said yeah. basically, if you shoot, I'll shoot. I don't know who the first shot was. He got one shot off. Right. He hit. Right. He yeah. hit Rosalie. He got riddled with bullets. Uh, before, I mean, so it's like, before, why can't they just squash it and fucking? Uh, like, because if you read the other report with Mikey, uh, he Mikey clearly states that Doctor Drake is the aggressor. What really? Yeah. So um, so he does have a complaint against Drake. Yes. Then, uh, yes. Okay. So if you meet, read the reports where, admittedly, Peter did shoot somebody. Um, and he said, yeah, like I did shoot somebody. Is it like, under Peter? Okay. Attempted second degree murder. Yes. This one. Yeah. Like admittedly he did shoot, uh, I think it was Perry, which of like, f honestly, fuck yeah. Perry. Like I understand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, honestly, yeah. fuck Perry. Like Perry's a, you know, he gets it. He has what's coming to him. But, um, like, even Mike, I fucking hate the formatting of that. It's very difficult for me to read. Yeah, but... he needs to, this is way too big of a block of text. Yeah, I, I was having trouble reading it and I read it wrong a couple of times. But admittedly, even though, uh, like, Peter had the gun out and everything, Dr. Drake continued to instigate. Which I think is just, you know, as soon as you have a gun out, as soon as there's a gun, maybe you stop talking shit. I don't know. Yeah. Because then, if I pull a gun, the thing I'm focused on is, man, I really hope I don't get shot. Not whatever the fuck was in my head before that. Because unless I'm misremembering how I read that. Am I wrong in how I remember it? Sorry, I'm reading this. Remember what? Sorry. Am I misremembering that Peter had a gun out and Drake was talking shit? No, it didn't say that. He okay. pulled the gun on Perry. That's when the gun was pulled. Oh, okay. Hold on. They they talked shit to each other and then separated. And then, Miss, then Perry came up and talked shit to Peter. And then that's when Peter pulled the gun on. No, no. Officer O'Neill arrived at the post office where Dr. Drake notified Officer O'Neill he oh, had a gun right. pulled on him. Yeah, but it doesn't state that O'Neill claimed that it was Peter anywhere in this report that pulled the gun. Fuck, I hate it these fucking reports. 
it, it just states then uh o'neill had a gun pulled and continue to report blah 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 why the weapon was pulled and by who this is when mr yin had come up to mr drake and began speaking with the doctor it says nothing that mr yin was the guy who pulled the gun oh my god o'neill Yeah, so the way it reads is he, you know, O'Neill showed up to, or got pulled aside by the doctor. The doctor was going to report something, and then it got interrupted. That's the way it reads. Okay, I see. I misunderstood and, he, and thought he, Yin had pulled the gun on the doctor in the first place. I, I mean, that may have happened, and then, right, you know, right. That's, but it's the that's, way the report reads. Yeah, I know. I, I just filled in that blank, but you're right. That's, you know. Yeah, unfortunate. Bad report writing, or... It was a random individual who pulled a gun on the doctor. And, right. And this was just secondary to what happened. Or the initial uh, reason Mike stopped to talk to the doctor. Um, nope, here it is. Dr. Drake was at the post office on Strawberry picking up a colleague. And when he was approached by M Peter Yin, Mr. Yin confronted Dr. Drake, becoming hostile. Mr. Oh, Yin yeah, pulled a, a gun on Dr. Drake. Okay, there it is. All right. Uh, at which point, Dr. Drake put his hands up and told Mr. Yin to put the gun away. Officer O'Neill arrived on the scene. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> to which Dr. Drake alleges that Officer O'Neill asked him, What did you do to get the gun drawn on you in the south side? I mean, it's a fair question. <laughs> Who whose statement is that? <laughs> it's, the, it's the statement of Dr. Drake's. But oh, I see. But Officer O'Neill asked him, quote, what did you do to get the gun drawn on you in the cell Yeah, side? I see it, I see it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dr. Drake states that Officer O'Neill then watched as Perry and Mr. Yin argued with each other as the scene escalated, claiming that 45 seconds passed, during which... Dr. Drake states that Mr. Yin stated that he was going to smoke him. Wow. So, like, so where, where, do, where, where, why did he pull the gun on Dr. Drake? We don't know that, right? Is there a previous incident report? Uh -huh. these two? Peter, okay, so Peter Yin pulled the gun and aimed at Dr. Drake, telling him to kick it from the south side. Okay, Peter Yin pulled the gun aimed at Dr. Nathan Drake, telling him to kick it from the south side. Dr. Drake put his hands up and tried to get him to put the gun away. Peter Yin put the gun away and said he would leave instead and walked away. And Officer Neil happened to drive up, and Dr. Drake attempted to report the incident. Yin walked back up, and Dr. Drake tried to tell Officer O'Neill that this was the individual that pulled the gun. Yin began saying, I'm going to smoke you, referring to Dr. Drake. Perry walked up and told Yin he wasn't going to do shit, and walked away. <laughs> and then, you know, Perry. And. Got, got. I'm stuck in MVP. Cool. Okay, I'm taking a nap.
As he feared. Dr. Drake. question here is right um, Sorry, say that again. i guess the question really is right one we need to talk to mikey oh fuck uh You know what's funny <laughs> is this is um could potentially be a conspiracy charge against um potentially but a oh howdy you're uh, right oh uh, it's just this so there's an, an additional Peter report. Yin in hospital thing yeah i got a yeah. report from dr lipschitz fearing for the safety of dr rose dr drake and peter yin for this yep. whole thing it's like 1498 or something. Yeah, just that's look the at number. my reports. Yep. It's just like, I don't know what the fuck's going on over there. So it's all complicated. But I just thought I'd let you know I had that report because I uh, ran into him. He said Poppy was working on something for him. So. I just added in a, a little bit, just my brief notes. I'll fill it out more later. Mm. 
like Peter says himself like he knows he has trespassed from the hospital he was going to meet with Dr. Lipschitz and Dr. Ruby uh, to try to iron this out he is trying to be respectful to the hospital staff he just has a problem with Dr. Uh, Drake and now Dr. Ruby uh, not Ruby sorry Rosalie Rose yeah yeah Um, but now he has trespassed unless he needs medical. But he is... Like, when I say his voice was, like, quivering, his voice was quivering. Really? Damn. Yeah. yeah. Like, he is afraid to go around because he... Well, yeah, he believes Carson he is, Crooks yeah. and the Lost MC are yeah. potentially, you know, have their eyes have on him. Have their eyes on him. From doctors. <laughs> From doctors. One, because Rosalie's dating one, and the other because, I guess, Dr. Drake's good friends with the Lost or something. Yeah. They just fucking so... Like, what is going on? And he's running for mayor. Yep. Yep. And you know what's funny? Hmm. The president of the Lost convinced me to run for mayor last night. He was the final one who kind of convinced me. He said that he would he would get the Lost to vote for me, so... I guess they're not too good of friends. Oh. Oh. Well, there might be a matter I, I wish to bring to you uh, about that. Um. You, you know the mayor has five votes yep. uh, on the board, right? Yes, I do. Well, what, what would you feel if, if I suggested or got your opinion on tax running for sheriff when that becomes an available oh position my, absolutely yeah you, you would have it he would have your support oh absolutely i think he would he would run a very clean de department he wouldn't let the, the bullshit happen like it's been happening here he what are they was it called nip it in the bud yeah. Yay. No, I I was excited. Harper told me that she was gonna be promoting him to captain, so Yeah, he, uh, he definitely has my vote of confidence. I want to live well, in the desert. Yeah, well, well yeah. I'm buying a I'm like... buying a farm in the mountain that looks over Sandy, so yeah, I mean I'd be right there. Oh, which one? Uh the one I hope I'm not getting too much competition on Baytree Canyon Road, right where it kind of like loops around, just uh, southeast of or southwest of the animal shop. Oh, we'll be neighbors. Yeah, hey, yeah, you guys, you guys are yeah. gonna be down by the church, right? Yeah, there's two two properties literally uh, on that corner where if yeah, I'm yeah. looking Pop, where it Poppy is. Poppy showed me. Poppy showed me. Oh uh, yeah, there's two places. We want the southern one. Uh, uh, Poppy wants to sleep on the mattress on the rusty car. Yeah, she showed me. So charming. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go work on a poster. If uh, you need anything, I'll just be up at my desk. All right, of course. Yeah. Again, yeah. if you need any assistance, please <laughs> give us a shout. Yeah, I have. Uh, I had a couple people uh, I was talking to last night. They're working on some stuff for me, trying to get like a poster uh, a day to put into the bulletin board. And, uh, yeah, you know, just I... gonna try to set up like a, a couple events so I can talk to some people, go around to the. Uh, no. I think Southside, what will be really good them. is that you're stepping down from your position. Oh, absolutely. Yep. I don't know. Yeah, if, like I don't know. First if, question yeah. I was asked by multiple people, so I've been leading with that now as yeah. well. Yeah. I don't know if Doctor Drake is doing that. I don't think he is. That's, I've stepped I, down I, I, just I, to run, not even like I, he may have to step down and become mayor, but uh -huh. that's not how that works, right? You should uh, go full in. I I feel I. Well, especially now with all this. Yeah, he's kind of not a good look. He's given... Is it, I, is I it won't personally it? use this against him, but, uh, you know, if other people start talking about it. He's given me the ick. A little bit. I uh, overheard some things while I was at the hospital about did him. You, did you not being... see his poster outside the front of, uh, of City Hall? Oh, no, I haven't. It's just a splash of blood that says City's a state vote for Drake. He doesn't even say what he's running for. It's such bad. Yeah, I thought I wasn't sure if he was running for mayor or council. Yeah, that's true. 
Well, regardless, I'm uh, just going to really get out there to try to win this thing. Because I do not have fucking confidence in anyone else. Yeah, well, we got confidence in you, so mm. that's something. Thank you, thank you. All right, I'm going to go work on this. I appreciate you, too. All right, anytime. Thank you. Wait, so wait, what the fuck do we do about Peter? Fuck. I don't know. I'm, I'm off wait, duty. Uh, what uh, hold on. Yeah, uh, I can, uh, hold on now. Uh, this sounds like a spat between two individuals, so we cannot confidently state with any any certainty which one of the individuals is at fault is I told him to get the restraining them, order that might be the best course of action i don't know how to do that though i just know it's in the constitution but i don't know how to do it that sounds like a matter for the judiciary that's what i thought i said hey go contact the lawyer figure this out it's above my pay grid yep I think there's just a charge for violating a restraining order, but I don't know how a restraining order gets in place. Also, the radio doesn't work in here. Figured that out. All right, back on duty it is then. Oh. My allergies are really bad today. Uh, your your what is bad? I'm allergic to the air. Oh lord. Hi hi, Papa. Oh, listener. Oh, what is uh, needed there, Muffet? Somebody oh, needs to be uncuffed from a bed at pillbox. Okay. M4. Oh. Two or four will be seven to six. What? So I hopped out of duty a couple of uh, hours. Uh -huh. We come back and Muffet tells me someone took a giant up at the staircase up to the roof. There's a poop there. Well, I think that's your fault for going off duty and you weren't guarding the staircase. <laughs> ah, so you're the pup bandit. No, it was not even in the building. You seem to find this awfully funny. For someone who's not the pup bandit? <laughs> I do not find it funny at all. Yeah, you're not going to find it funny because now you're going to come no, with I'm not us going up to clean and inspect. It up. No. No, you're not going to no. clean it up, but you're going to inspect the pup. I'm not going to inspect it. You're going to inspect the pup. I'm not going pup. to inspect it. Okay, would you look at the photo of the pup? No. I don't want to. What does this guy need? He needs... Ro do you need Rosner? I mean, I don't he... know if Poppy's able to do it. I don't, you I, talk I to mean, Poppy? What, what's up? The, uh, the charge from yesterday for the robbery thing. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, let me see. I got fucking called that dumb bitch uh, lawyer Kensington so many times that uh, I decided to change my hair instead of slicking it back completely. I just let it, you know, kind of flow a little bit. I don't know let if I'm it, gonna stick with it. Let it down. Oh, uh, I feel okay. like I look like a cokehead, and I, I direct porn, pornographic movies. Yes. Yeah. So I'm, I'm. I might go back to a you know more clean look, but I guys just hate being mistaken for a shitty lawyer when I when I am not in fact a shitty lawyer. I'm sorry to hear that. Wait, what was I'm, their I'm, last I'm, name? Uh, Crane. K R A N E. Your hair grew back, Muffy. That looks great. Slowly but surely. I see, I see. Hey, you sound you sound a lot more upbeat. You, didn't, you don't look as de depressed and uh, and sad. My boyfriend threw me off the back of his motorcycle last night. Oh well, uh, never mind. I completely retract my last statement. On purpose? No, it was an accident. Oh, I see. Oh, go ahead, folks. Go ahead. How can I help you guys? I'd like to file a report. Sure, what happened? Murder uh, too. Oh my god. Wait, what? Second degree murder. Oh, that's an officer. Poppy, you wanna take you wanna uh, take that one? Give me a second. Okay, I so just watched the clerk at my twenty four seven get her head blown off. 
Did you see who did it? I have a description of the suspect. Okay. Yes. Um. So I've not had to. I've not had to do this before. Um. So I think yeah, the only person I've the yeah. only person I've had do it is uh, Dan Marino. So okay. I, I I'm not sure how exactly he did that, but yeah. Uh, so I think what I'm going to have to do is create a new. I tried to look up. Oh fuck! Who was it for? Uh, Frank King. That he did it for Frank King. Okay, he took off a. Up. He took off a, a, a manufacturing uh, a drug charge. I don't know if he how he would have done that. She's dead. What store did this happen at? Encino Beach, 24/7, about eight minutes ago. Okay, the one by Chumash, yeah. Yeah, South Chumash. Alrighty, um, I can go ahead and kind of give officers okay. a heads up to keep on the lookout. We're a little. I'm not sure how exactly right he did it. So okay, yeah, I, have it, it I have it. I have it here. All right. Um. Self safe and you see that guy okay. again? Just call it in. Let us know where you see him. We can try to send. I called around. you immediately, but nobody answered, so we came in. Yeah. Okay. Um. So this is going to be. No worries. Please uh, find this man. We need justice for my clerk. We'll try. Uh, we'll have you jumped try. over this counter, maybe? You tried to report this Excuse earlier, me. maybe you jumped over the counter and you were very... No, I literally just walked up, Norway. Mm. What, what do you want? Uh, no, no. I'm just thinking maybe... Maybe you took a little work. I'm going to have to, like, take no, a nap, I think. So maybe you no. had to badly... Okay, this is for both, both Lucas and Marcus. Maybe you... Uh, just, just Marcus. Just Marcus. Oh, just Marcus. Okay. Right. Yeah, just Marcus. Uh, thank you. I appreciate you. But yeah, I don't, I don't think Lucas was charged we'll with the, the robbery itself. Oh, uh, yes, he was. Oh, was he? Oh, fuck. Well, that, well, yeah, that no, definitely not for, for Lucas, no. but uh, just Marcus at the moment. It might be for Lucas here in a bit. I didn't know about that. Yeah, because Marcus. because of the Constitution, yeah, because of uh, I got you. Yeah, you know, the, the accomplice uh, gets charged yeah, the yeah. same as the primary. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I would say don't hold off on that uh, Lucas one for now, because I obviously we haven't agreed yeah, to anything. Yeah, we agreed to anything. anything. Yeah, yeah. So just for Marcus yeah. then. Okay. So what I'm going to do? He is currently. Your best bet is probably just to PO him. I don't think he's paid off any of that fine yet. No, so. no, he is not. So okay. it is. Yeah, I told him he not is, to just be on So he's still going to be. Uh, PD, be advised. Still going to get kidnapped at ammunition currently. Yes, what is like two hundred, three hundred, four hundred bucks. So he's still going to get possession of a stolen vehicle and robbery. Sense. Yeah, robbery. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Robbery act. Okay. okay. Uh, so let me. I'm going to exempt him of his current fine, and I'm going to put in a new fine. That's pro oh, Yeah, that that actually, makes sense. That's probably how it worked. Yeah, we can kill two birds with one stone. If you were True. to sing at an an EMS event, how much would you charge, and how much, and how many? Songs? Oh yeah, somebody sent me Screen a letter about something about that today. Oh yeah. That was yeah, that was me. What's the uh, event? Um, so we're having like a kind of appreciation party uh, for the doctors in uh, U.S. Please. Uh, we're gonna try to have it six, at 10, the resort that's on Great Ocean. I'm kind of going party. in. I'm clearing this um, out of my vehicle. Yeah, so kind of like a little time where they don't have to think about work. They can just relax, have fun, have some drinks, and listen to some good music. Do you know what day? Uh, it would be Sunday the 11th, uh, right after storm. In the morning or in the night? Please. In the morning. Oh, fuck. I have a delay fucked out early. Oh. Mm, okay. And... Oh, come on. What time is it? Oh. Jesus, come on, Muffy. It's 9 a.m. So That's a normal time for a normal radio. adult to be awake. Oh my God! Just have uh, never mind. That's 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 Give completely crass and, and wrong in an unprofessional uh, setting. Yeah, I, I'll wake up and come. I'll be, I'll be good. I might, okay. I might be tired, but I can do it. Yeah, I mean, I mean. Okay, he's going to have seven days to pay these fines. The fines is going to be uh, four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars total. Yep. So, All right, uh, thank you very much, Mr. Bobby. I'll yep, let him no know. More, so and no more, and no more. There's no jail time. Sure so, okay. um, Sounds good. Yep. All right. Uh, Sweet. Uh, Sweet. Uh, I'm going to just put this in now. The yeah. The lady who paid me, paid me like 500 bucks. Okay. Okay. Sure, if that's a... Pay me 500 bucks. I think that's like the standard kind of rate. Okay. 
Okay. We can, uh, All right. Eli, go ahead and write Thank you very much, yep. Poppy. All right, no problem. We'll make sure to have be in there. Pleasure doing business with. Yep, no Hi. problem. Let them know. Thank yep. you. Thanks see you around. Bye. I'll yeah. see you guys then. Being an adult is just so hard. <laughs> Truly, the most accurate statement. Two four seventy six to the shots fired. Yeah, so I know fun. as um, he's on an LOA, so I don't I don't know where he would be. I think you could. Your best bet is just finding him around town. He's gonna kinda like this is two first six break break yeah, break. I see PM. four individuals here with a hostage at the commercial rubbery. Oh, fuck. Looks like it's about to go down over here. And then it's seventy. Two thirty seventy. I'm I'm coming. Fuck cat. Two four same traffic. You catch them criminal bastards. Yep, that's the one. I'm gonna be up, uh, posted up on the Olympic freeway here. Gonna get some pictures. Oh my god, cat, please. <laughs> I fucking hate you, cat. So much. See, I'll be 76 to the latest uh, commercial robbery. How many units do I have responding? Uh, Go we, on, uh, We have 24. Is, we need EMS for 24. He is ejected from his vehicle. Alright, EMS is on route. I see 246 on scene already. 46, respond. 230 is in route. 246 and 204. 246. Cut! 240. No way! 204 is 23. I have a blue. There might be a primo at the front, blonde head, female, uh, blonde head, male, wearing a, is that a devil dog's jacket? Uh, and then we have a man in a suit with a gun at his head. Uh, I'm gonna be stepping out the vehicle now. Uh, back in radio here, gonna have a picture of the vehicle and plate uh, from the highway here. I believe I see some individuals back here at the world. I'm gonna go down in uh, code 6, the uh, outsides of the world. Would you, would you like 246, to we're going to need you over at the front. We only have two units available. How we doing? I'm doing alright, how about yourself? I'm doing just fine. Right, okay. You're not planning on hurting this individual now, are you? I ain't planning on hurting him so long as we have our demands met. Alright. Uh, sir, what's your name? A shout out there, I can't hear you. Boy. I believe. My silence is broken. Your 21st actors. Bob, Bob, what's... Okay, I can hear you, ma'am. Ma'am, what's his name? Uh, his name is Bob Dana. Is that what you said? Bob Dana? Oh, all right. Bob, is Bob I don't hurt? see anything in the Bob? canals or at the other side of the world. All right, okay. I believe we'll 224 has uh, been right. ejected from his vehicle, possibly. Right. Can we roll we medical? Me, me, RDM. So, for the same Answer. Thing, 46, I would need you on the uh, next to me. We have three, we have three, we have three, we have three other individuals. They are running. Yes, we do need medical for 24. I thought they were already incoming. All right. Okay, let me relay uh, on Capitol? Offices, all right? All right. Yes, on Capitol. He is ejected from his vehicle. Uh, 204. Uh, they are gonna... They want 
free passage and all spikes uh, for the safety of this hostage, an individual by the name of Bob. Uh, all four individuals, or at least three of them, are wearing uh, devil dog jackets. Two females, two males. Uh, Poppy, can I get you to take the hostage? Uh, I've already taken photos. You don't need to take photos. I it's on. Oh, wait, get in your car. Alright, I've already taken photos. I have photos already. Uh, I'm gonna take primary. Papa's gonna take the hostage, and then uh, I'm gonna get you to, to, to take secondary. I know it. To answer. Yep. Alright, I'm going to step out the vehicle to take the hostage. Alright, tempo. Okay. Okay, you're going to come over here with the hostage, okay? Okay. Okay, I don't want no funny business. No now. funny business here. Okay. It's nice yep. and slow. Nice and slow, there, nice and slow. No, no, you free pass it back. But do not point the gun at any of my officers, okay? Okay. All right. All right. You might have to put your hands up again there, Bob. There you go. Okay. And Bob, you're going to come right over here. Vehicle. Right over here. Okay. Spam. Okay, Bob, did they hurt you at all? No, they were okay. very nice. In fact, they even picked me up and carried me so I didn't have to walk. Wow, that's so kind of them, Bob. Bob, I'm just going to have to search your pockets, okay? Make sure they didn't put anything on you. That's fine. Okay, can I just have your hands up? Turn around for me, please. Uh, yep, there you go. Okay, and I'm also just going to check your ID here, okay? Okay. And they didn't take anything off of you either? Nope. Uh, where did they pick you up from, Bob? Ammunition. Uh, on, uh, around the corner from Malta Street. Okay. Ammunition off of Malta? Yeah. And how many were there? Four. How many male and female? I think there were two of each. Uh, what description uh, can you give of any? Mm -hmm. Late, it was a lady who was holding me and they, they all had black jackets on and she had a smile bandana over her face. That's about all I know. I was kind of freaking out so I really wasn't paying much attention. Okay. All right. I'm going to quickly uh, just check, make sure nobody else is here. Okay. All right. And then we'll drop you back, okay? Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm Officer Poppy. Officer Poppy, I'm Robert Dana. Okay. Well, that was left, the first time west, I was ever a hostage uh, in anything. Avenue. Well, I'm glad it was not too Did horrible for you. Avenue. Well, I always heard you got to remain calm, so uh, yes. right I'm kind of a calm north, person anyway. So uh, Edward Way, shaking on the inside. You turn in. I'll stop stopping in the road here. Okay, now you turn in. Stuck in the road. Okay. All right, southbound. Seems from what I heard, right. that happens a lot in this uh, town. Cutting across, yeah, but now we're trying to prevent it Spanish. as best as we can. Back onto Boulevard Del Perro, westbound. Did they catch him? Uh, oh, left, south, that way. I'm going to do our best. 
to southbound that went Thunder Drive left, uh, southeast door sits, spinning out. Well, if you do catch them, if it's okay, any consolation, they were very nice to me. Okay, well, I'm glad for that, as, as long as they continue to be, you know, nice known. and cooperative. Found also drive. Very patient also, because they wanted me to get in the trunk, but I couldn't seem to be able to do oh, it. Oh, I see. Were you uh, at the same aviation left, store up north, here? North, left, going to yep. Sullivan. Okay. Cross an occupation. Cross in Hallwick, northbound. There you go. That's the gunner. Thank you so much, officer. You have yep, a good no day. Problem. Good luck catching them thieves. Yep. Still northbound, Criminal. left, Laguna's Boulevard. Okay. You need 77. Yes, please. Holy shit. I'm alone. Oh, oh, first I think they're re really All right, uh, what happened to the 95 there, Nova? Oof. No, wait, what happened to the 95? Is this the pair? He's what, sir? He had some sort of emergency or something because he just disappeared. Right, okay. Southbound Las Lagunas Boulevard. Understood. Did he know that he was under arrest? Yeah, he was in cuffs, so I assume so, in, in, in my cursor. Alright, 10 4. Southbound, peaceful, right. Uh, westbound, Vespucci Boulevard. Approaching Red Garage, passing Red Garage. For six here, I have your secondary. We're gonna be taking a right there, parallel to the white garage and northbound Calais. Taking our immediate right, there's bound. A left and northbound, uh, Las Lagunas Boulevard. 230 attaching. Gonna left there on the Milton Parkway, gonna be uh, west bend on doors. Continuing west bend, there's it. Left, south bend, the Palomino up. God, I hate this car. Slowing down, space of approximately 50 for that. Southbound uh, Palomino towards uh, Little Soul at this time. Passing Weasel on the left. Continuing south now, eastbound uh, Palomino up. Correction, Westbound. Are we heading towards the beach here? Disregard. Taking a right towards the Spooky Post Office. Gonna be uh, west and northbound by City Avenue. Continue northbound uh, by City Avenue. Coming up to the pier here on our left. Taking a right south of the motel. Uh, gonna be eastbound Red Desert Ave. 1050. Still mobile. Vehicle uh, U-turn there. Gonna be uh, westbound Red Desert Ave. Gonna be taking a left southbound uh, on uh, Bessette Avenue, heading towards uh, passing uh, Vespucci PD here. Alright, uh, I gotta open this to a uh, pits and box. I'm oh, sorry, pits and spag. And fair. Continuing is San San Andreas Avenue. A little uh, left bump here, we're in Northbound San Andreas Avenue. Bucks, bucks, bucks. Disfigured, back mobile. Third time movie star away. Oh, left there, uh, parallel to. Movie star away. Driving here along the preps. Go, go, go. We're gonna box him here. Try and tempt him to box. Get out of the car. Vehicle's out. It's over. Ow. It's over. Surrender. <laughs> Surrender. I got the blonde. Zing, Momo.
Everybody's out on foot chasing the blonde. One ninety-five in custody. Norway is going uh east. We will start away. Still pursuing on foot. Norway is. Parallel Heritage Heights. And then North Heritage Heights. Tackle her! Tackle her! Tackle her! I've lost eyes on Norway. I got her. She's running uh, south on Marathon Ave. Oh, she is fucking fast. Stop! I'll give you a milkshake! No, no, I don't want no goddamn milkshake! Okay, what do you want? Um, for you to leave me alone. Oh, that's not happening. Uh, she's going up, uh, I have to get out of the vehicle. Oh, no, right, Norway's here. Go back here. It's going up the garage structure on Boulevard del Perro. Do you have any additional? She went back down the stairs. She has to. Okay. Technical. Okay. Remember to remember to tackle. Was chasing one. Do you eyes on her? Up and uh, to the left off of Dorset. Oh, I have eyes on her. She's heading uh, west to Dor Cougar. I think South Morning with Boulevard. She is on foot still. Sir, man, you're not getting away from this. Ending through the alleyways, North Morning Wood. Can you get away from me? You're not getting away from this, ma'am. Why not? Because you're just not. We already have your friends. Just just come on. Go to jail with them. I'll I give you some time off. Oh, are you, are you for real? Yeah, I will. All right. Oh, put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Yeah. Put your hands up. Gonna, okay. I was trying. I, I have I have her. She's surrendering. Okay. Okay. Uh, man, at this time, you have the right to remain yeah. silent. And, oh, and you say you can will be used against you in the court of yeah. law. You have the right to oh. an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, won't be provided by the state if available. Do you understand these rights? I understand. Okay. You're welcome for the workout, man. <laughs> 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 okay. That's what you got. 
That's not justice. That's not okay. fair. Okay. All right. Oh, okay. Yes, okay. Let's go. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. That was one hell of a workout, man. How yeah. you feeling? Oh, just make wait sure until you get the cum down there. Oh, make you're sure, gonna feel like shit. Sure, make sure that you get you you know you hide right there, man. It was a lot oh, of running. Yeah. Okay. If you have some roller skates. You may have ah. to skate. My car, back at the regional side. Yeah, well, can you mark okay, her Okay, okay, thank God. Uh, 204 back on frequency. I have 195. What's the status of the other pursuit? I have a 95. 10 4. Uh, where are uh, like there. there. Oh, so it's 395. Alright. 4 out of 4. 204 76 back to, uh, on Davis PD 195. Uh, could you just uh, reach back into in Bakar? Yeah, 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 yeah. You do? Uh, 22 my last. I'll be 76 to pillbox medical. My 95 okay. requires there you go, medical. Ma right. Do you Thanks, require man. any medical? No. I could actually use some medical. That okay. Nice. Okay. I'm just I, going I to took, drop him I off. Took, I think me and this fella here took quite a spill. Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to drop him off at his car first, and then uh, we will go That's there. over there. Yeah. 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 I'm dropping Norway off at his car, and then there will also be 76 to pillbox. Wait, is your name Norway? Oh, there's my, there's my car. Where I is drove it? it up a bit. Yeah, back uh, one more lap. No, my name's Trick Baharaz, and it rolls off the towing. I see why they call you Norway. Yep. I want to stick with Norway. Oh. That's a nice nickname you got there, actually. I am Captain Norway. Captain all captain. the bad guys. I'm Officer Norway. There we go. There captain we go. all the bad guys. All right, what's your name back there? Uh, are you going to be upset? Why are you going to be upset? Why am I going to be upset? I don't know. It's it's, it's Victoria Parker. Hi, Victoria. You can call me Vicky. It's fine. Hi, Vicky. Hi. I'm not going to be upset. I'm going to be upset if you kept running. Listen, man, I was trying to... I get to get my work Why not? No, Look, I just, I'm glad you didn't fucking shoot. Then I would have been upset. I get mad when people shoot. I don't, I don't, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. I don't like shooting myself, so you ain't gotta worry about that. Now, you know, I ain't shoot unless someone's shooting at me, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Yeah, I don't like, I don't like shooting either. I feel quite bad when I have to shoot people. Yeah, so. me too, man. It's... Oh, sorry, I've had, like, such bad headaches today. I've been trying to go off duty, and, uh... <laughs> this is not working. We're gonna take shortcuts, right? <laughs> well, shit. Oh, man. Yeah, I mean, the car's already fucked. Yeah, it's so fucked. bad, yeah. I think one of your friends has a really, really bad. <laughs> it's not bad in that one. <laughs> Park by the dumpsters. Okay. Okay. I'll be out of the car here. Thank you. Yep. Oh, yep, there we go. And they help you inside. Maybe. Oh, they try. I mean, I can, I can yeah, walk. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me just... Relax my own ring. Okay. There we go. Justice. The smell justice. of justice. Hey, justice. Yeah. Could I possibly have you uh, process her? I'm feeling very unwell. Yeah. yeah, I'll do it. Okay, thank you. Good news, our doctor just became available. Scumbag. Great job, uh, Poppy! Is there a doctor yeah. available? Criminal scumbag yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Norway! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We okay. did it. We did it. Hi, yeah, she's going to need some medical. Johan, uh, patient for you. Let me off first. Uh, sorry, I can't. Yeah. Oh, they did work this time, though. Oh, oh god, I can't see it. Yes, I, I felt yeah, it. I, I felt it. Yep, I felt it. Can you see now? 
Yeah, I can see now. Okay, cool. I'm going to let Nori take you. Uh, Nori, uh, she did surrender, so um, please give her... You uh... call that surrendering? She did surrender. I, I chased her down four... Blo Easy for you to say you were in the... You promised me time off. Yeah, I, I, said, I said, yeah. I said, if you stop now, I will give you time off, and she did. Did you surrender? Oh, You're lucky Listen, I'm quite man. the hicker. Listen, and my man, cardio can, is can... tipnuch. Yeah, it was pretty good, man. We can talk this out, man. Come on. Yeah. All right. We'll talk. I'm, I'm stuck. Oh. Stop. Just stop. Stop it. Stop being stuck. Okay. okay. Yeah. So I to get her some work. medical, I still have not searched her or anything. Um, but I'm feeling incredibly ill. So. Yep. I really have to okay. go. Okay. You feel better, Papa. Yeah. I'll take okay. care of this. Okay. Great. Thank you. Ooh, five dollars. Mm -hmm. mm, five dollars. Mm, Don't burger. take my five bucks. <laughs> Guys, who do you want to say hi to? Oh, let's say hi to. Let's, that's not a question. Let's say hi to you. Uh, okay. Washington. One person is outside the cab. Okay. Alrighty, guys. I don't know if I'll be back around later. I'm, I'm feeling, ugh, today. Super ugh. Especially being like one of three on duty. Ugh. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Uh, two thirty going forty-two. I'm not feeling great, but have a good night. God bless. Now, pop it. And guys, but as always, please, 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 have a good day, have a good night, take care of yourselves. I'll see you next time. Welcome back, sir. Ma'am. Or ma'am. I'm sorry. It's I'm okay. sorry, ma'am. Oh, I'm so sorry.